much history over the last six months. We'll try to encapsulate as much as we can. We'll tell you who's going to miss for the Celtics here game one and maybe beyond. And then we'll break down game one because it's much worse on the other side. But are there truly ghosts to the playoff losses to Miami in the air? Are the Heat still truly scary, even with Jimmy Butler, who, of course, they'll be without? We'll discuss the Eastern Conference title defense season for Miami, which, believe it or not, was significantly better than their 2023. We'll take our trip around the NBA. Opening day of the NBA playoffs belong to the home team. Four games, four wins for the higher seeds, and no fan base louder or more ready than the ones that packed Madison Square Garden. McBride has the ball. Hart on the right wing. One dribble, fires a contested three-pointer. It's good! Our game one check-in with the head coach, Joe Mazzula. I mean, one of, the, one of the biggest growth areas for me as a coach was going through a playoff series as an assistant, the, uh, the ownership that you take. But coming up next, 64 wins, NBA records left and right, and quite simply, one of the greatest regular seasons in NBA history. It all gets moved to the back burner today. So one final look back at the most dominant 82 games the Boston Celtics have ever produced. The final seconds tick off the clock. And the most dominant season in the history of the game's most storied franchise comes to an end. It's all coming up and more as we catch it out of the Celtics and Heat. Game one, top of the hour on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics radio network. If your lawn looks more like a desert than an oasis, then you know that lawn care isn't easy. If it were, everyone would do it, as well as True Green does it. In just three easy steps, True Green's online tools help customize a treatment plan for you. And it's all backed by the True Green Guarantee. Go to TrueGreen.com today to start your three easy steps and save 50% off your first application. It's time to trust your experts at True Green. Live life outside. Chocolate and pretzel? Pretzel and chocolate! Mmm. Sweet, salty, crunchy flips. This flips everything. Made the bed by Thuma, the perfect platform bed frame. Thoughtfully handcrafted from upcycled wood, the bed is strong, backed by a lifetime warranty, and ships directly to your door. Assembly takes five minutes, no tools needed. To get $25 towards the bed, go to Thuma.co. That's T-H-U-M-A dot C-O to receive $25 off your purchase of the bed. Shop the bed at Thuma.co. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at CarStar. Explore the endless possibilities and visit carstarjobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's carstarjobs.com. Start your journey with us today. Connect with Boston's home for sports online, 98.5thesportshub.com. I knew it was going to be Miami. I knew it from a few weeks back, but, uh, um, you know, just coming from last year to this year, um, it just it just makes sense. So um, we're looking forward to it. should be a great challenge. Miami is a tough team, well coached, play hard, they're physical, all the stuff that, you know, we need to emphasize. Yeah, Jalen, I think we all knew it was going to be Miami at some level. And, of course, that's the way it turned out. Welcome back to Shaw's and Star Market Celtics today, the Game 1 edition. And it feels like, in so many ways, the 82 games were just played so Miami could come back here. Yeah, well, it's just unfortunate. You think about not Miami coming here, but no Jimmy Butler. No doubt. This is really a, a different team, and no Terry Rozier. He won't be around. But Miami has a hard time scoring the basketball. Celtics really don't care about that. What they want to do is go out and establish dominance early in this game, make sure they keep their foot on the gas, and win this basketball game to see, send a clear message to not only to Miami, but everybody in this league. All right, so we got a lot of ground to cover here. Let's get to it. Luke Cornett will not play for the Celtics here in game one. That was a bit of a surprise. It was a difficult week. Joe Mazzulla put through their paces this week to try to speed things back up to get ready for the, you know, the ramp up, if you will, as the kids like to say, because how long has it really been since the Celtics have played a meaningful game? Hey, it's been it depends a while. on your definition of what one is, but it's been several weeks plus the regular week off you have. Celtics haven't actually played a real game meaningful or not in a week since they closed out the regular season here last Sunday. That's part of the uh, discussion when there's nothing else to discuss. Is it Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. 
Mm. A little sugar? Yeah, more sugar. I find that if you're going to eat a Danish, because the sugar content isn't high enough, washing it down with a soda is probably the best case. Why, why, why wouldn't I? Well, if you are. Stays, look, I said, stays in the family, Sean. In this age <laughs> of unprecedented offensive efficiency, you are one of the most calorically efficient people. You can pack a lot of calories into a small meal. And that's, you know, again, that's valuable because we're all very busy. You were pretty busy yesterday. By the way, can I address the rumor here, oh, yeah. the rumors that have been flying? Yeah. Larry Bird, Kevin McHale, Robert Parrish, they're not walking through that door today. Yes, they'd be gray and old, but they're not walking through the door today. That's not uh, happening. That was just they made an appearance I, I, yesterday no, that you I, were alongside, which is pretty. Hey, listen, the photographs, everything, it looked really cool that you guys were all together. It, it was. We had a great time. Uh, people think they're coming this game now. Uh, Larry Bird was leaving town. Uh, uh, Kevin McHale left the afternoon, and Robert Parrish left in the morning. Robert Parrish did tell me that he was going to come back to a playoff game later on. Uh, Larry Joe Bird, I don't know. All right, we'll get to Max's player to bank on. One little insight here on the matchup, and obviously why there is still fear when intellectually there shouldn't be. But there are reasons for that because the Miami Heat tend to conjure that. But before we look ahead to the series, which is now upon us, one final look back at the most dominant 82 games that the most storied franchise in history, the Boston Celtics, have ever produced. Opening night has arrived, number 78 for the Boston Celtics. They'll wear the familiar road green uniform, white letters and numbers. They will go left to right. The New York Knicks in the traditional home white, orange letters and numbers. Blue stripe, they will go right to left. It will be Mitchell Robinson to jump it against Kristaps Porzingis, who began his NBA career here in this building as a lottery pick of the Knicks. And the 2023-24 season is underway. Porzingis wins it back to Derek White. Out of way we go. White bounce pass for Tatum. Straight away against Barrett. Got Porzingis. Right side. He's going to take the deep three. Got it! Dagger by Porzingis with 89 seconds remaining. And the Celtics have scored nine straight down the stretch to lead by three. Boston ball. Tie game. 2.06 to go. Drew Holiday. Right hand dribble. Zips into the corner. Jalen wants it. Three in the air. Got it! Ooh. Jalen Brown breaks the tie with two minutes to go with a left corner three. Jalen Brown, deep on the right side, going to take a three. No good. Would have moved him past Marcus Smart on the Celtics all-time list. Derek White runs Brunson down from behind and just rips the ball away. Grand theft, Derek White. This could do it here. Tatum to the corner for three. Good night. Ooh, Man, somebody get some grease up because they fried. Up in here. 14 in the corner, 32 in the game for Jason Tatum. Back out punch. Tatum wants it, he's got it. Dribbles the Celtics up the middle of the floor. Gets a Horford screen, zips into the corner. Derek White for three, got it. And the Celtics lead by 13. Everyone's dreaming of a white Christmas. 124, 115, but we're about to enter minute 48. Right now, Porzingis floats it to Tatum. Tatum, one dribble drive, finds White coming strong. Two-hand slam from the baseline. A white Christmas to all and to all a good night. Well, there's your punctuation mark. Butler saves it back into high spence and throws it away. Picked off by Jalen's two-hand slam to a cross-court to Hero. Jalen spelled that out. Telegraph. <laughs> Google it, kids. Jalen gets hurt again. Here's a step back. Straight away three. Got it. A 23-point first half for Jason Tatum. As the great Apollo Creed once said, they told him he didn't think it's a show, he thinks it's a fight. They only started to methodically pull away. Tatum lead for Derek White. Bounce pass cross court. Jalen Brown coming strong on Sim. Scoops to the right hand and scores. On wherever they want to go. Just extending this lead. Ten straight for the Celtics. It's up to 17 now. 88-71. And I'd say the Celtics are on a level right now the Knicks can't match, but I don't know if anybody in the league can. Tatum, handoff, Horford for the 20-point lead. Big fella is on point. On point, on point, on point. 95-75. Enjoy these moments as they're happening. Durant from the left elbow, jumper no good, rebound Hauser. Tatum's need two assists for a triple-double. Lead for Jalen, on the right side, three, good night. A 15-0 run as the Celtics 
throwing some haymakers now. Pump fake, kick out. Porzingis open, three in the air. Bounces out. Offensive rebound, Horford. Kick out, Porzingis. Up takes the three. Zips the entry to Whitehorn all alone for the easy two. The Pistons have lived all night long on the offensive glass. They may just have died by it. Derek White with the entry to Jalen Brown against Brunson. Even Chenzo shows double team. Now he comes, Jalen gets it away to Derek White. Slack drive, finds the open man in the corner. Holiday three, got it. Oof. Boy, they're making it look easy now. This time rotating, passing, knocking down shot. Somebody get, hey, somebody give Tibbs a hug out there. He needs it. Right hand, left hand, puts him to sleep, steps to his left and knocks down a three. This is as brutal a beatdown as you are ever going to see. In and I love it. I love it. What, what did we say about Tatum getting off to the slow start? He's got 16 now. Tatum against Sharks. Steps back away from him. Three in the air. Got another one. The Boston Celtics with the nation watching lead Golden State by 40. Enjoy every second of this. Every minute, every play, every second. As the Celtics' brim brand of a regular season continues tonight. Shot clock at four. Tatum switches to the left hand. Now back to the right. Dives in. Scores with a finger roll. And the Celtics have a ten-point lead with three minutes to go. Wiggins driving. Oh. Trying to flush it up. Porzingis. He got met at the rim and rejected. Whew. Holiday for Jalen Brown. How about a good night three? You bet. Jalen Brown. Four for 14 in the first three quarters, five for five here in the fourth. This isn't the last time you're going to hear 2008 referenced, but for the first time since that magical spring, the Boston Celtics have clinched the best record in the NBA. It is win number 60, and they do it in knockout fashion, as they have done all year long. The best team in the NBA crosses the finish line first. The final score, Boston 135, OKC 100. Season recap brought to you by DraftKings Sportsbook. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app and use code SPORTSHUB. New customers can bet 5 bucks to get $200 instantly in bonus bets only with DraftKings Sportsbook and code SPORTSHUB. The crown is yours. Remember that uh, Stratomatic preseason computer simulation I've been talking about all year that had Boston and Minnesota playing in the finals? Yep. You know how many games it had the Celtics winning when it came out in September? I mean, 64. Whoa. Exactly the number that they won. By the way, it also had them sweeping the Miami Heat in the playoffs. Wow. So maybe the computer set, maybe AI already has taken over. I don't know. What I do know is that the things that have to get corrected, yeah, the Celtics have to play. are going to see more zone defense in this series. But there are two things that stand out, one of which people were still afraid about last year, and yes, Jimmy Butler and Jimmy this and Jimmy that. Last year in the Eastern Conference Finals, Caleb Barton and Gabe Vincent shot 50%, 38 of 76 from three. Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum shot 18 of 90, 20%. If that happens again, maybe Miami can make it a series. It's not going to happen again. Wow. No, you're putting that up there, aren't you? I am. But I will, I will give you the other big number here, which I think is part of what drives the fear around here the last few years. And it's about this building. In the last 92 regular season games the Celtics have played here, they are 77 and 15. In the last 27 playoff games, they are 12 and 15. And that is what is going to have to be corrected. And nobody will believe a 38 and 3 regular season at home doesn't matter until you win the home game. Absolutely. Game Considering the fact you played so well during that time, now the boogeyman just came in the building. Miami Heat, but uh, it's a different team. Just get ready. Play with reckless abandon if you deceive. All right, no Jimmy Butler, obviously no Terry Rozier, no Josh Richardson for Miami. Duncan Robinson was a game time decision. He is going to play here in game number one. Max's player to bank on, brought to you by Clinton Savings Bank. Get the home court advantage this spring with CSB's Safeguard Mortgage. You can modify your interest rate once within the first five years. Perfect for when rates go down. Let's all hope they do. Get details at ClintonSavings.com. Member FDIC, DIF, equal housing lender. Uh, why not just go the same way you go with Tatum Tatum the pressure is on him during these series you want to get off to a good start Jason Tatum's your leader 
Still to come on the Game 1 edition of Shaw's and Star Market Celtics today, our conversation with Joe Mazzulla. We'll take our trip around the NBA. Four games yesterday. The home team won all four. But coming up next, Mark Dondero has Sports Hub headlines. Bruins got off to a great start here last night, blasting Toronto in game number one. The Red Sox starting pitching continues to be absolutely ridiculous as they try to complete the sweep in Pittsburgh this weekend. But it's all leading to the Celtics and the Miami Heat back together again. It's game one of the playoffs. Top of the hour on the Bet MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics radio network. If you've ever spilled grass seed on your lawn and accidentally created the world's largest bird feeder, then you know that lawn care isn't easy. If it were, everyone would do it, as well as True Grain does it. Our science-driven expertise ensures your custom, nutrient-rich treatment works to deliver a greener, healthier lawn. And it's all backed by the True Green Guarantee. Go to TrueGreen.com today and save 50% off your first application. It's time to trust your experts at True Green. True Green. Live life outside. Who's in for Mohegan? Obviously everyone. It's an invitation that you can't ignore to experience a place that just feels different. Mohegan Sun, a place that welcomes you in, all in. For the flavors, the fun, the unbelievably unforgettable. Because you plus me plus Mohegan equals the best time ever. And what comes next is, well, everything. This is how it feels when you're all in for Mohegan. Mohegan Sun. Visit MoheganSun.com today to start your experience. Chocolate and pretzel? Pretzel and chocolate! Mmm. Sweet, salty, crunchy flips. This flips everything. Advertising is a race. No matter what products or services you're advertising, if your campaigns aren't winning, you might be left on the track. Stack Adapt. Speed that makes the difference. Learn more at stackadapt.com slash advertising. Now you can save on Cox Internet by adding Cox Mobile, so you can do everything you want, everywhere you want. Stream the big game with fiber-powered speeds at home, or capture it courtside on your phone with unbeatable 5G reliability on the go, so you can do more without spending more. Learn how at cox.com internet. Cox Internet is connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Not all services and features available everywhere. Other restrictions apply. Celtics play here at the Sports Hub. Sports Hub headlines. The Boston Bruins dominated game one of their first round playoff matchup with the Toronto Maple Leafs. Five to one the final. Jeremy Swayman made 35 saves and Jake DeBrus scored two goals as the Beast secured the one nothing series lead. Game two will be Monday night in Boston. Jim Montgomery has not publicly stated who will be in net for the Bruins in game two. The Red Sox dismissed the Pittsburgh Pirates for the second straight game on Saturday by the count of four to two. Masataka Yoshida had three hits, including a home run, while Cutter Crawford threw six innings, allowing just one earned run while striking out six. As Boston will go for the sweep this afternoon. Josh Winkowski on the hill for Boston, opposite Edward Olivares. Also bad news for the Sox as well, after they placed Tristan Cassis on the 10-day IL with a left rib strain. Cassis currently has the third most home runs in the American League with six. Finally, the New England Revolution dropped their game on Saturday, 1-0 to the uh, to Toronto. That was the final. They now prepare to face Lionel Messi and Miami next Saturday night at Gillette Stadium. Sports Up Headlines brought to you by Valvoline. Quick, enjoy quick and convenient vehicle maintenance this month. Visit NewEnglandOilChange.com for 15% off your drive through oil change at Valvoline Instant Oil Change. Now open in Raynham, Reading, and Braintree. I'm Mark Dundero for Boston's Home for Sports. 98.5 The Sports Up. Grandy and Max will go around the NBA next right here on the BetMGM 98.5 The Sports Up. Celtics Radio Network. David Pasternak plays here. High slot now, McAvoy, far side. Pasternak shoots, looking for the tip. It comes back to him. Fires. He scores! He's got another. Marshand, high slot, looks back door. Swings it across, popping out. Pasternak shoots. He scores! Marshand has got it right. Circle first round to Pasternak. Shoots. He scores! This is the home of the bees. 98.5 The Sports Hub. Spin your passion into a business with Shopify and break sales records with the world's best converting checkout. Let's hear that one more time. 
world's best converting checkout. Shopify's legendary checkout makes it easier for customers to shop on your website, across social media, and everywhere in between. Now that's music to your ears. Any way you spin it, you can be a smash hit with Shopify. Start your dollar a month trial today at shopify.com slash records. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile and the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time. There's Granger, offering professional-grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, click Granger.com, or just stop by. Granger, for the ones who get it done. Ugh, time to tackle my to-do list. You mean all those doctor's appointments you've been putting off? Exactly. I think this says eye exam? Just book one on ZocDoc. You can search all kinds of doctors by availability, specialty, location, and read reviews from real patients. Okay, what about a primary care doc and a dermatologist? Again, ZocDoc. Gastroenterologist next? Nope. Brunch. You've got more options than you know. Download the free ZocDoc app to book today. Listen live. Check out our podcast with the 98.5 The Sports Hub app. Our trip around the NBA presented by the Massachusetts Health Connector. Act now. Get covered at mahealthconnector.org. And now the Nuggets can get it down to 55 seconds to go. Backdoor cut. Dunk to hands. Nikola Jokic. Nuggets lead it by 11 with 71 seconds to go in game number one. And this thing is over. Jason Kosnicki on the Nuggets radio network. A lot of people thought, Max, the Lakers should not have won that game, right, to get Denver in the first round. Well, that's their ninth straight loss to Denver. Yeah, no, and, and I think that last time they beat Denver was like 2000, yep. four or five years ago. It's like crazy. Knicks win at home. They beat the Sixers 111-104. You think that's going to be a really competitive series? I do. I like the 76ers if, in fact, Joel and B can stay healthy. A lot of people are picking Phoenix over Minnesota. Timberwolves take game one by Ant-Man. 25. The yeah, Anthony Edwards is great in that game. And Nas Reed's going to be sixth man. It's a really fun team to watch. And the other half of the Celtics Miami bracket is the Cleveland Orlando series. Cavs win easily in game one, 97-83. Magic really having trouble scoring. Second half of the year, it's going to continue, it looks like, in the playoffs. That's your quick trip. Around the NBA, we'll talk about the other game ones that are going to take place later as we move along. Celtics and the Miami Heat back together again on the floor for game number one. We'll talk about it with Joe Mazzula next on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub, Celtics Radio Network. When you find a deal on your favorite thing in the McDonald's app and order it, does that technically count as online shopping? Save money with the app. Ba-da-ba-ba-ba. At participating McDonald's, prices may vary. Elevate your look with sales. Shop diamonds and gold essentials or discover a diverse mix of emerging talent and established brands in our designer edit. Whether you're just starting to build your jewelry box or looking for something new, book an appointment with a jewelry expert today to help guide you through our curated selection, including new arrivals, and find your next must-have at sales. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. The generative AI revolution is coming to your smartphone, and it's fueled by Micron Mobile Solutions. Generative AI applications use billions of parameters to translate your text into images. Micron Memory and Storage Solutions feed these parameters into generative AI models at light speed, turning your smartphone into a mobile creative workstation. See how Micron Innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. BackstageCountry.com, your online home for all things country music. 
Like most fans of country music, we're excited to learn that Luke Combs was back in the studio working on his next album. We've come up with our list of iconic Luke Combs music videos. Yes, Lovin' On You made the cut. Text Luke to 45911 to see if your favorite made the list on BackstageCountry.com. Text Luke to 45911 and we'll send the link straight to your phone. The home of the Rivs, the Sports Hub. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification on the 98.5 The Sports Hub Celtics radio network. The home of the Bruins, Patriots, Rivs, and Celtics. Boston's home for sports is 98.5 The Sports Hub. On the Beasley Media Group Station. The Coach's Interview is brought to you by Shaw's and Star Market. Download the Shaw's and Star Market deals and delivery apps today. Save on groceries and gas. Go shopping. Get rewards. Shaw's and Star Market, the official supermarkets of the Boston Celtics radio network. Now let's go to Grandy with head coach Joe Mazzula. All right, Mark, thank you. At long last, the day is here, and it, it feels like it's been a while since we've had one of our, our pleasant chats. Take people through the prep this week on two fronts. We'll get to the... I'm always fascinated by the scouting of four possible teams. But what you're focused on is what still is a relatively new phenomenon, the play-in week, giving you seven days between games. And because of the unique position this team put itself in, I, I don't know what we call meaningful games, but it feels like it's been a while. As a result of the ramp-up, as the kids like to say, how did you manage this week physically and then intellectually in pre- pre- preparation for today? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, balance is important. So you definitely, it's almost like a mini training camp. Um, to where I actually thought it was a positive that we didn't know our opponent till late because we're able to work on the things that are important in the playoffs regardless uh, of who you play. And I think it's the, the scouting and the adjustments and the opponent get so much talked about that um, there's a level of things that you have to do regardless of who you play that puts you in position to win. And uh, that was kind of our main focus this week was uh, sharpening those habits, sharpening those philosophies and the details of what goes in re- w- of winning regardless of who you're playing, and then plugging that into uh, yesterday's practice once we realized who our opponent was. It is, is it a full staff scout of the four teams, or is one person that's generally assigned to the four, and if so, does one person feel like the winner when their team is the one that... Um, you definitely, <laughs> I mean, I've been on both sides of that. I know, so yeah. You definitely feel a sense of... Uh, you, know, you definitely feel a sense of accomplishment uh, and a sense of relief a little bit after a playoff series is done because, you know, uh, there are uh, individual assignments for defense and offense, but we also have teams to where those people can, those other coaches can support the, the scout coach. And, um, you know, so it's a, it's a huge, I mean, one of, the, one of the biggest growth areas for me as a coach was going through a playoff series as an assistant, the, uh, the ownership that you take, uh, the time that you spend on it. And really that's where you learn to manage the game because, you know, it's me and that scout coach working together throughout the entire game based on, uh, you know, what they're doing. How was that different? Go, let's go back to the assistant coach thing in a playoff series. How, when you finished your first one, you got through your first playoff series, you said, this feel, this is so much different. How, why? Yeah, my first one was Miami Eastern yeah, Conference Finals. Yeah, that's right. Uh, it's different because you, you take ownership. Uh, mm-hmm. You know, it, it's the things that you want to do. Uh, you work together. Me and uh, assistants work together on, like, okay, this is what you want. So I think it's the first time that, an assistant becomes that understands the uh, not necessarily the burden but the uh, ownership of decision making and I think that's important and uh, I felt that my first playoff series I felt the burden and the ownership of decision making to where most of the time uh, you know assistants are giving suggestions but I think in a playoff series when you play the same team seven times and you have a specific scout coach it's like okay these are these are decisions now Uh, and that really helps you grow as a coach and and it puts your team in position to win. All right, when you say, as you have this week, that a playoff game is no different from a regular season game, it may hit people as counterintuitive. Are the things that are different about the playoffs, and obviously there are things that are different, is that what you're, the message you're communicating, just the external stuff? Yeah, I mean, the internal stuff, it's a basketball game. Uh, there's a box score, there's, there's uh, execution, um, you know, it's the margins. I think what we've tried to do here in the last couple of years is um, have a process towards winning regardless of the situation, preseason, regular season, playoffs. It's just playoffs are under a much external duress, higher duress, higher physicality, uh, higher sense of urgency. But I think that's a test of anybody in any realm is can you do the simple things under higher duress, right? I think when you talk, when you hear people in their fields talk about 
greatness and execution and things they've been able to do. It's like, can you can you make the complex simple and can you do it under extreme circumstances? And I think that's what the playoffs is, is, you know, uh, heading into a series. If you don't rebound, if you turn the ball over, uh, you don't fight for your spacing, if you don't execute, you're not going to have a chance to win. Uh, and I think those things are, are the most important. Isn't that what every day is, is preparing your mind and body so that the external stuff can't get in? Exactly. Um, and, under, and not being distracted by... Uh, you know, do I do do I need to do these external things in order to win this? Or and at the end of the day, it's it, it, you know after going through uh, a bunch of playoff series as for you know two great coaches, Brad and Ime, it all comes down to the simple details of execution, along with the open mindedness too. There will be some, I'd say three to five decisions that you have to make throughout a series. Like last year, we decided to change the starting lineup and go with Rob and Al, and uh, and go double big for Game Six and Game Seven. So there are three to five. Uh, you know, major things that you're going to have to make a decision on to put your team in the best position to win. Uh, but, you know, at the end of the day, that doesn't matter if you don't take care of the, the margins and the details. There's going to be extraordinary energy in this building, and that means different things to different people. You and the staff and this group have put in so much work to have the regular season you had. Are you intellectually curious slash excited for what is about to happen? Uh, excited. Yeah. Uh, excited. I think um, this team's worked really hard uh, on, you know, mentally and physically throughout the season to put themselves in position. Uh, we have an opportunity here. There's no denying that. And I think that's important to know is we have an opportunity to do something special, to make a run here. Uh, but we can't be distracted by, again, you know, what's most important. And at the end of the day, it comes down to there's certain themes heading into a certain series. Themes here are spacing and passing versus their pressure. Um, and then our one-shot defense. And, you know, those things are need to be the loudest things that we uh, hear uh, amongst ourselves uh, heading into this series. Loud would be a good way to describe the environment here in game one. Enjoy. Yeah. Thanks, buddy. Celtics and the Miami Heat. Game one next to the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile, and the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time, there's Granger, offering professional-grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, click Granger.com, or just stop by. Granger, for the ones who get it done. Spin your passion into a business with Shopify and break sales records with the world's best converting checkout. Let's hear that one more time. The world's best converting checkout. Shopify's legendary checkout makes it easier for customers to shop on your website, across social media, and everywhere in between. Now that's music to your ears. Any way you spin it, you can be a smash hit with Shopify. Start your dollar a month trial today at shopify.com slash records. Chocolate and pretzel? Pretzel and chocolate! Mmm... Sweet, salty, crunchy flips. This flips everything. Advertising is a race. No matter what products or services you're advertising, if your campaigns aren't winning, you might be left on the track. Stack Adapt. Speed that makes the difference. Learn more at stackadapt.com slash advertising. Oh, happy Monday. For real? Yeah. My Mondays feel a lot better since I found an amazing therapist. Ugh, jealous. I really need to find a good therapist, but I don't know where to start. Find and book the right therapist for you on ZocDoc. Look, the patient reviews say that Dr. Taylor is super compassionate, she's in network, and available tomorrow. What would I do without you? Probably look for a new job. You've got more options than you know. Download the free ZocDoc app to book today. The only place to hear the game, the Sports Hub. It was a dream season. 82 games of almost unprecedented dominance. Opening night has arrived. Number 78 for the Boston Celtics. Tatum, one dribble drive, finds White coming strong. Two-hand slam from the baseline. A white Christmas to all and to all a good night. Enjoy these moments as they're happening. Durant from the left elbow. Jumper no good. Rebound Hauser. Tatum's need two assists for a triple-double. Lead for Jalen. Right side three. Good night. A 15-0 run as the Celtics 
throwing some haymakers now. Pump fake, kick out, Porzingis open, three in the air, bounces out, offensive rebound, Horford, kick out, Porzingis, up takes the three, zips the entry to Whitehorse, all alone for the easy two. The Pistons have lived all night long on the offensive glass. They may just have died by it. One year ago, the Miami Heat ended the Celtics' pursuit of a championship on their home floor. So what better way to begin the path to redemption and perhaps banner 18. Celtics and Heat game one is next. This is Boston Celtics basketball. The 1957 season is over. The Celtics are the world champion. The Celtics are brought to you by BetMGM, the king of sportsbooks and presenting sponsor of the Celtics radio network. Please bet responsibly. Clinton Savings Bank, Catcher's Law, Valvoline Instant Oil Change, Shaw's and Star Market, perfecting the art of fresh. Amica Insurance, your New England Ford dealers, Apex Entertainment Center, and by Cat's Eye Pest Control. The ball game is over. The Celtics have won the world championship by town fair tire cambridge savings bank nissan bosch tools gulf oil 110 grill and by Ticketmaster. the boston selling have won the world championship for the 15th time and by mass mutual michelob ultra east coast metal roofing your new england honda dealers umass lowell massachusetts health connector and by DraftKings sportsbook it is banner 17 the mission statement is mission accomplished now Here's Sean Granty and Cedric Maxwell. At the cauldron that TD Garden becomes this time of year. It may not be the very definition of full circle, but 11 months ago, the Miami Heat won the Eastern Conference Championship on this floor in Game 7. Who would have imagined that their title defense would begin right back in the same building in Game 1 of the Eastern Conference quarterfinals. The starting lineups brought to you by Cambridge Savings Bank. Put CSB into your small businesses. Starting lineup to move your business forward. Creative solutions and quick decisions. Visit CambridgeSavings.com backslash small business to start your relationship today. No Jimmy Butler. No Terry Rozier for Miami. So it will be Caleb Martin that starts with Tyler Hero in the backcourt. Remember Tyler Hero didn't really play in the Eastern Conference Finals a year ago. Jaime Jaquez has had a really strong rookie year with Nikola Jovic who's been a starter for most to the second half of the season in which the Celtics really haven't seen Miami and of course defensive player of the year candidate all defensive player Bam Adebayo is going to have to be enormous on both ends in this series the Celtics played much of the year with one or two of the starting five out not today in game one Derek White, University of Colorado. Drew Holiday, UCLA. Jalen Brown, California, Berkeley. Jason Tatum, Duke University. Christos Porzingis, Baloncesto Sevilla. Max has been a fan base that has been overcome with the element of fear that Miami has conjured because in two of the last three years that they have met in the playoff, it has been Miami that's taken the Celtics out of the conference finals and advanced to the NBA finals where obviously they lost both times. Is there any logical reason for a Celtics fan to fear an eight seed Miami team that does not have Jimmy Butler? I don't think so, but Miami does have a culture. Miami does play a certain way. And if there's a team right now that's going to extend you, it will be Miami with their principles. You've always talked about teams playing with margins. Miami plays to those margins. And you saw they arguably played one of their best games of the year once they knew they weren't going to have Jimmy Butler on Friday night, blowing out Chicago in the final playing game. Remember, last year they were trailing in that game with 90 seconds to go and had to come from behind to win where they advanced to Milwaukee and beat them in the first round. The opening tip brought to you by Gulf Oil. It all starts here. Gulf, the official fuel partner of the Boston Celtics. Celtics win the opening tap. Porzingis beats Bam out of bio, and away we go. Celtics in the traditional home white going left to right. Miami wearing the regular forms of the black and white trim. Drew Holiday, Anderson, Jason Tatum, drop, step, spins, dives in, got hit by Martin Ball, got knocked away, but he's got the offensive rebound, kicks out to Jalen Brown for three. I love the fact you attacked that rim early on, trying to get a high percentage shot by, by Tatum. Tyler Hero against Drew Holiday, who plays in a Boston-Miami series for the first time. Bam out of Iowa with a big block on Tatum in game one in 2020. Missed a jumper over Porzingis and the rebound for Derek White. Jalen Brown up the right side, drops the shoulder, oh spins on Hawkins, oh. drives and slams in two hands. Hawkins still looking around saying which way did he go. Oh my God, Hawkins. Where did he go? Hawkins brings Miami into the front court being hounded by Jalen Brown. 
Bam out of bio, top of the circle, hand off Tyler Hero. One dribble, throws back to out of bio. Return to Tyler Hero, high left hand dribble, pulls up top of the circle, long jumper, no good, back iron, rebound, pinballed around, and Jason Tatum comes out of the pack with it. Tatum up the left side of the floor. Caleb Martin waiting for him on the wing. Here's the entry, the first one, first touch for Porzingis against the smaller Hero. Short little jumper is good. And got him right in the paint. Mouse in the house. I love you operate right there on the box. And the Celtics score the first seven. Tyler Hero ducks the shoulder. Holiday cuts off that drive. Tries the left side, nothing there. So he floats it to Bam out of bio. Hands off on the wing to Hawkins. Right hand dribble coming strong. Past Derek White. Try to go in and dunk it. Yeah. Blocked at the rim by Porzegas. Jalen Brown up the right side, throws the shoulder into Caleb Martin. Backs into the mid-block, double team comes, kick out, gets to Tatum. Before Hawkins can get there, Tatum drives strong, runs it off the window and in, and Eric Spolstra has already seen enough. That's where you get in the building, man. You want a good hit? Dance, partner! Dance him with the doggone stars! Celtics are going to be rusty, Max. That's what everybody said. They've been off for a week. Wow. A minute 55 gone by in the series. Boston 9, Miami. No score on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is connected to the premises via coaxial connection. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. Without the ones like you who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you with professional grade industrial supplies. Count on real time product availability and fast delivery. Call clickgranger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. Advertising is a race. No matter what products or services you're advertising, if your campaigns aren't winning, you might be left on the track. Stack Adapt, speed that makes the difference. Learn more at stackadapt.com slash advertising. Cuando fumo marihuana, me pierdo en la música. Me enfoco en cada instrumento. El bajo rítmico, las armonías del piano, la melodía contagiosa. Hey, hey, hey. Amor, cuidado, hay alguien cruzando la calle. Sorry, no lo vi. Si te sientes diferente, conduces diferente. No conduzcas bajo los efectos de marihuana. Es peligroso y es ilegal en todas partes. Un mensaje de Nitsa y de Ad Council. Felger and Naz, afternoons 2 to 6 on the Sports Hub. First five minutes brought to you by your New England Ford dealers. Now during Truck Month, get a great deal on Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 47 years straight. Well, you can script the start for the Celtics in the first minute, 55, and we look a little bit like this. They lead 9-0. Celtics moving the ball around. I, you heard me call the Porzingis bucket when Tyler Hero was the only one there. Bam out of bio late to join the play because he's out on the perimeter. Bam did an amazing job on DeMar DeRozan the other night. But Miami doesn't have the luxury of not having Bam in the paint when Porzingis catches him. Well, Porzingis catches in the paint. This is different. So no offense at all to Rob Williams. Last year, Rob Williams catches that basketball. He kicks it out. What you have to do is the Southerners know they have to punish Miami anytime they make a change or rotate and make sure you want to just get that guy and punish him on the inside. Remember, new faces here who haven't experienced this. Jaquez in his first playoff game. Jovic, who was not playing or in the rotation the last couple of years for Miami. It'll be Bam's job to hold this all together. And man, they, they need Tyler Hero to be Gabe Vincent and Max Struess and all that combined uh, Ant in this man. series. Maybe just be Ant-Man. Maybe enough. And how much are they going to be putting on Bam? He's the one bringing the ball up here into the front court, finds Jovic. Jovic right-hand dribble gets in deep. Tries to float it out of the wing. Pass got deflected, but it gets to Hakev. Hakev's right-hand dribble shut off by Jalen Brown. Throws back out to Caleb Martin. Derek White waiting. So the shovel pass for Tyler Hero. Hero turns on Derek White. Steps to the baseline, tough shot, forces it, no good. Smothered, Miami smothered on that possession. Oh. Tatum, the defensive rebound. Great defense all over the place. Tatum watched by Jovic out of the wing. High right hand dribble, bounce entry. Here's Porzingis, backing Jovic down. Porzingis turns into a double team, kick out Tatum. Shovels to Holiday, open three, got it. Punisher. 
You, you rotate, you trap, getting it to the open man. 12 nothing Boston. Bam out of bio. Looking for the cutter. That's deflected and stolen. And here comes Drew Holiday racing into the front court. Holiday stops at the nail. Kick out Tatum on the wing. Tatum moves to Porzingis again against the small with Tyler Hero and his jumper is perfect. <laughs> Tyler Hero cannot guard Porzingis. So he's getting in a, a mismatch. He has to guard him at that point. 14 nothing is the Boston start. Taylor Martin over the shoulder pass. Here's Bam in close. Porzingis waiting. So Bam going to put it to the floor. Spin back to his left. Fall away and hit. And finally, three minutes and 17 seconds in. Get Miami on the board. And a tough shot, though, with the fall away jump shot. 14 to 2. Behind the back bounce pass. Tatum for Porzingis. He bricks the three. Rebound hits Drew Holiday. He's got the offensive board. Kick out Derek White. Shovels it to Tatum. He's going to try the three on Hakez and stick it. And even when you take a bad shot, good things are happening. The Celtics are 7 of 9, and they've gotten offensive rebounds on both their misses. 17 to 2. Tyler Hero, bounce pass. Here's Bam. Bumping into Porzingis. Turns, uses the window, and banks it home. That's a tough shot. Again, banking, falling away. 17 to 4. Jalen Brown shakes off Jovic's left-hand dribble drive. Pump fake. Now the kick out. Derek White, pretty good no. look at a three. Nope. And the rebound for Bam out of bio. So you can't. Not again. You take that shot. Those Celtics getting okay. good looks, and they're going inside to get them on the outside. Miami down 13. Here's Bam out of bio. Foul by Porzingis. They're going to give him that shot. It won't fall for him. Circles the rim. And Bam out of bio will get free throw. This is a great looking move this time. Going back and use that hand just extending up the seven brother. It's been four minutes and 13 seconds into this series, and I can already tell you, Bam Adebayo is going to need a massage tomorrow. They are going to depend on this dude. Yeah, not to work, man. He rattles home the first free throw. He's got all five Miami points. Yeah, he was that guy over the last couple of years that made a difference, especially in the paint, attacking. He did so much against attacking Tatum. I think one of the great blocks we saw was in the bubble where Tatum went to dunk it. That was game one. And it turned the series heavily in Miami's favor. That series, Bam Adebayo just dominated Daniel Tice, and that was the big difference in the bubble conference finals four years ago. 17 to 6, Boston by 11. Drew Howden, handles to Tatum. Baseline extended against Caleb Martin. Ake shows double team. Tatum jumps into contact. Ball knocked away, no call, but Tatum's got it back for the shot clock. Tatum dribbles out on the wing. Steps to his right. He finds Derek White at the last second. Three is in the air. It's no good. And the rebound for Bam. First bad possession you had over dribbling. Bam out of bio up the middle of the floor. For Tyler Hero, he's looking Hakez's way against Derek White. That's where the ball goes. Hakez pounding the shoulder into Derek White. Turns, fades to the baseline. The rookie has his first NBA playoff points. A 6 nothing run for Miami. It's 17-8. Jalen Brown enters in deep to Holiday. And he exposes the ball. Slapped away by Bam out of bio, but it goes right to Porzingis. Wow. And Porzingis gets run into. Caleb Martin is trying to follow Tatum. And Tatum just led Martin right into Porzingis, and he knocks him over. Wow. That's dangerous. Big guy standing up like that just ripped, ran right through his body. All year, all year at this point, the substitution was made. Holiday and Tatum would come out. Horford and Hauser would come in. Instead, it is Peyton Pritchard who joins Al Horford in this first substitution. Peyton Pritchard's made a nice little run. He's been so good here in this last month. Remember, he got the early call in the conference finals last year, and it did not go great. But Jimmy Butler was on the floor back then, and they would hunt him in every matchup. Jalen Brown up fakes the three, gets to the free throw line, steps in past Martin, shot going to come up short, but Martin picks up his second foul, and Jalen Brown will shoot free throws. Guys, a man up in the air there. Hit him with the body. Man, Caleb. Man. Caleb is right going. in the face of Brett Barnicky, who made that call. Miami Bench is having a brief conversation about using a challenge. Well, I mean, which what they always say is you get that man up, up in the air and he leans into you as Brown. This is the first of two free throws. Yeah, Jalen did not have a great year from the free throw line, particularly in the second half. He ended up at 70% even, among the lowest in the league among qualifiers. And picked up that second foul then on Martin. Martin, the primary defender. But think of last year. <laughs> he looked like Kobe Bryant. He did. The way he shot the basketball and attacked the rim.
Haywood Highsmith will get the early entry. Jalen misses both free throws, so Miami on a 6-0 run and the ball here. Haquez, moving to his left, Peyton Pritchard waiting for him. Haquez throws the shoulder into the smaller Pritchard. Spins, good defense, bounce pass out, Bam drops it. Ball loose on the floor, who's going to come up with Derek White fell down. So Miami's got it, Jovic throws it out to Haquez, swung to Highsmith, open, right side three, comes up short. They need all of those open shots to fall, and the rebound for Horford. Jalen Brown dribbles around, Highsmith goes in strong, switches to the left hand. Floater blocked by Jovic, but Jalen had it back. It's going to eventually go out of bounds, let's say, off the Celtics. Yeah, great. I'll be Jokic down. Oh, just ready to get that basketball before Brown can get it out of his fingertips. And Jovic is really good. Jovic, I've seen some of the chase down blocks he's made to make. It's a highly skilled player. And a shooter. Tyler Hero, deep on the left side against Peyton Pritchard. Midway through the first quarter. Right now, if you're sticking up with ABC, Hockett driving on Porzingis, turns, fades, tough shot, altered by Porzingis, loose ball. Pritchard came up with it, but they're going to say he fouled Tyler Hero in a loose ball situation. So this will go back to Miami. And Peyton Pritchard goes right back in on the other side, just really just pushes his man. Good call by the officials. Peyton Pritchard late to the party there with the push. Miami again, very, very active. Celtics haven't scored in two and a half minutes. Their lead is nine. Tyler Hero gets the Bam out of bio screen, pulls up, 20-footer in the air, tough shot, no good. Defense has been on point here for the Celtics, Porzingis the rebound. Hand in the face all the time. Jalen Brown, offensive end, stop and start, driving on Jovic, hangs in the air, runs it off the glass, no good. Scramble for the rebound, Miami's got it, Jovic, he's on a move. Pritchard trying to chase him down, trying to alter this running one-hander, which is off the window and in for Jovic after the Euro step. Eight straight for Miami, Boston lead down to seven. Peyton Pritchard, lobs it for Porzingis, baseline extended against Hockey. Porzingis, up fakes, and Hockey reaches in, punches the ball away out of bounds. Celtics will keep it with 11 to shoot. Good little recovery about Miami. I mean, you talking about making some, make some things happen. And that's the battle tested, all the cliches about Miami. This is going to be, Celtics are going to have to play extremely well to win the series. Just why wouldn't you think they're going to is the point. Pritchard, side of the bounds, in safe for the Derek White, nine on the shot clock, White. Right hand dribble, bounce pass back for Porzingis, up takes the three on Bam out of bio, spins on him, good job by Bam to shut that off. Jalen Brown throws to the corner, open, Pritchard, three, got it. That's At the shot clock, Porzingis. Well, that utilized that clock, that burnt every single second on it. However, the Peyton Pritchard we saw last year wasn't nearly the same Ooh. animal confidence-wise. Air ball by Jovic, and Jalen Brown has the weak side rebound. Celtics by 10, and the ball. Big three by Pritchard, turn the momentum. Now Pritchard going to drive. Jovic there, shut him off. Kick out, and a bounce pass fielded by Porzingis for three. And that weapon that he has right now is crazy. Seven for the throwing darts, man. Nightmare for Miami. The first five threes of the series have been knocked down by the Celtics. We lead by 13, 23-10. Hero turns the corner, drives. There's that one-hander, that left hand, off the window and in. We do a lot with that for Miami, 23-12. Jalen Brown, slow down by Highsmith. On the left side, Porzingis coming over to set a screen for his buddy, Jalen. At the elbow, lobs it for okay. Porzingis. Terrible pass, picked off by Hero. Jalen turns it over. He threw it to where he thought Porzingis might be. Hero driving past Derek White. Derek White stays with him and blocks the shot into the hands of Al Horford. Derek White coming the other way. Slowed down by Bam Adebayo. 23-12, Boston by 11. Porzingis up fakes the three, enters to Horford. He's in behind everybody. Steps through. Highsmith gets there to reach out and tie him up for a jump ball. Wow. Horford, Horford didn't go up right away. He made a move with the ball, and that allowed Highsmith to get there. Somebody just left an old man in the building. That old man, 13 years ago, Kevin Love, set the record for rebounds in this building, and that record still stands. 11 years later, in 2011. There was a beast back in that day. 24 rebounds for Minnesota. Duncan Robinson, game-time decision. We'll also check in here with Kevin Love to play with Highsmith, DeLon Wright, out of Bio and Jovic. Celtics win the jump ball, but they only have five in the shot clock. Tatum, deep on the right side, ball fake, step back, three, short, rebound, Horford, kick out, Tatum, another three, wow. blocked partially by Jovic, and the rebound comes down to DeLon Wright. Wright fell down, wanted a foul call, didn't get it. But Miami will bring him into the front court, trailing by 11. DeLon Wright, 
at the elbow. Porzingis waiting for him. Stop and start. Right drive. Scoops and scores. Porzingis got leading the wrong way, and Joe Mazzulli going to call a timeout. It's a nice little tricky play. Going back over his body with that basketball. So, very nice recovery here for Miami. Little 12-6 run, and they've cut it to 9. 314 to go. Opening quarter of game one. Boston 23, Miami 14. On a bit MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island Jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile. And the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time. There's Granger, offering professional-grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, click Grainger.com, or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. The generative AI revolution is coming to your smartphone, and it's fueled by Micron Mobile Solutions. Generative AI applications use billions of parameters to translate your text into images. Micron Memory and Storage Solutions feed these parameters into generative AI models at light speed, turning your smartphone into a mobile creative workstation. See how Micron Innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. Spin your passion into a business with Shopify and break sales records with the world's best converting checkout. Let's hear that one more time. The world's best converting checkout. Shopify's legendary checkout makes it easier for customers to shop on your website, across social media, and everywhere in between. Now that's music to your ears. Any way you spin it, you can be a smash hit with Shopify. Start your dollar a month trial today at shopify.com slash records. Smart Wool makes merino wool socks and apparel designed to keep you comfortable because they want to help you play, explore, and thrive outside with every thread they knit and every step you take. And the right comfort can keep you outside, so you can do all the things you live for longer. Smart Wool. Go far, feel good. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. The home of the bees, the sports hub. First five minutes were brought to you by your New England Ford dealers. Now during Truck Month, get a great deal on Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 47 years. He'd have calmed it down. Celtics have missed seven of their last nine shots. Their lead is down to nine. 23-14 Celtics with 3-14 to go in the first. What I want to see Al do is when he gets those rebounds on the inside, you look around and going, man, is there a shot block out there? No, Al, go straight back up with that basketball. Don't look to attack. You got a hopper and send the shot around the rim. I'd rather for you to take it than anybody else at that time. Miami was the number five defensive team in the NBA this year, but they were the number one defensive team from February 1st on, which is basically the second half of the season. Only 20 times out of 82 did they allow teams to get 1.19 points per possession, but it happened in all three games against the Celtics, and it started that way here. Derek White, kick out. Hauser, his first touch is to find Horford in the corner. Three is flat, no good. And the rebound fielded eventually by Duncan Robinson. Celtics now missed eight of their last ten shots. Miami with the ball down 23-14. Can Miami score without Jimmy Butler? They weren't able to during the regular season, but they certainly did in the play-in game Friday night. Beating Chicago, blowing them out. Hockey, bounce entry for Kevin Love. Going at Hauser. They're on the Hauser hunt right away. Shovel pass by Love to the cutter. He threw it right behind DeLon Wright out of bounds. Double team came over with Al Horper. Immediately 
Kevin Love read it the right way, passed to the man that should be open, but the man that should be open ran away from the basketball. Derek White out, Drew Holiday returns. Two low turnover teams. Miami sixth in the NBA. The Celtics were the best turnover team in the NBA. Taylor. Miami scheming this thing up again. So you're gonna get a, they play more zone than anybody. Whoa. They swing to Pritchard right side. And there's your zone buster. Three more for Peyton Pritchard. Shoot. The Celtics lead by 12. Is deep. deep shots. The Peyton Pritchard confidence level shoots right through the Miami zone. Oh, yes. whoa. Yeah, he landed. Whoa. He got away with a travel. Whoa. Everybody in the building knows it except the three guys officiating. Hawkins falls to the ground, loses it out of bounds. And even if it was deflected, no way they were going to give that ball. Oh, no <laughs> way they were giving it to Miami. You can't do triple jump. Hauser for the corner. His three is no good. And the rebound of the weak side for Kevin Love. Sam Hauser did not have a great finish to the regular season shooting threes. Right kick out. Trailer Kevin Love. Tatum out to challenge that. Now DeLon Wright. Think about Veteran. Brock Wright's tricky, man. He's going to get some run here without Rozier. Love turns, fires a three, and buries it. Been doing it from the second he walked into the league. Had to follow Kevin Garnett in Minnesota to be the guy, and he was. Holiday down the middle of the floor. Defense collapses to the kick out. Horford swing to Pritchard. Another three. No good. Wide right. And the rebound. Hawkins has it ripped away by Hauser, who throws out the Horford and misses the three. And the rebound eventually goes out of bounds off Miami. Man. Looks like it might have hit Holiday. The Miami bench is looking at the replay, but Celtics are getting open looks, and when they're missing them, they are swarming the glass. Remember, the Celtics' trouble on the defensive glass in many ways started with that game in Miami in February. Tatum. Been quiet here at the start. Somebody in the paint. Five and a shot caught. Tatum against Highsmith. Tatum blobs it for Horford. Kick out diagonal. Pritchard another three. That one short. Shot clock buzzer. Another offensive rebound. Horford kick out. Pritchard shovels it to Holiday. He launches one. That's a bad shot. And an air ball. It was a bad shot by taking it. Highsmith. Long lead for Hawkins who lays it in. And Celtics got what they deserved on that one. You just get to the paint. 9-3 run here for Miami. They've cut it to 7. 26-19. You're going to miss some threes, but you want to take good ones. Tatum, push pass for Holiday. Here's cutting into the paint. He finds Horford for the floater. That is no good. And the rebound for Kevin Love. Celtics have really gone quiet here. Three for their last 16. And yet, still lead by 7 because the defense has been so good. The line right for Hawkins. Here's the entry. Kevin Love. They're going at Hauser. Turning. 12 feet. Got it. Nice run here for Miami, 11 to 3. Celtic offense been out of sync. Holiday pressures as it comes across half court. 14 on the shot clock, 15 on the game clock has been counted down to the first court. The zone has really slowed the Celtics down. Holiday diagonal kick to the far corner. Hauser for three, it's no good. Rebound belongs to Highsmith. They've got five seconds. Highsmith hits half court, three seconds to go. He shovels it to Robinson, who's forced at the buzzer, is blocked by Holiday. That's how the first quarter will come to an end. The Celtics were very good on the defensive end. Forced three turnovers. Miami only made one three. Celtics took some bad shots late in the first quarter to lose some offensive momentum, but still lead by five at the end of one in game one at the Garden, Boston 26. Miami 21 on the Ben MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. Without the ones like you, who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you with professional-grade industrial supplies. Count on real-time product availability and fast delivery. Call, clickgranger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's Internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to 1 gigabit per second. Cox Internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. So, you've got an idea for a business. The store of your dreams. There's just one thing to figure out. Everything. 
That's why Shopify's all-in-one commerce platform makes it easy to sell online, in person, and everywhere else. Sell on social media, source products with an app to get that first sale feeling. It's the only solution that gives you everything you need to sell everywhere you want. So when you're ready to bring your idea to life, power it up with Shopify. Sign up for a $1 per month trial period at shopify.com slash listen. Connect with Boston's home for sports online. 98.5 thesportshub.com. Celtics basketball brought to you by East Coast Metal Roofing, official roofing partner of the Boston Celtics. Visit eastcoastmetalroofing.com, your lifetime roofing solution. And what we just saw was this series played out in two different parts. Mm-hmm. The first three and a half minutes, what the Celtics want and needed to be, and the last eight and a half minutes, what Miami wants and needed to be. The Celtics, and this is what happens when you're facing a heavyweight that can throw bombs the way the Celtics can. In the last eight and a half minutes of the quarter, Celtics were three of 17, and they missed nine of 10 from three. Yet they still lead by five because when they're on, they're so unstoppable that just that three and a half minutes, they were able to build a 15 point lead. Yeah, and, and did it quickly of knocking down shots and moving the basketball. But Hauser has to be able to kind of come out of his slump here. Yeah. And let's just call it what it is. Hauser was so good all year. And then for that last, uh, maybe the last month, so I say most of the year, but that last month it just kind of really slowed down. Pritchard, Horford, and Hauser took nine shots in the first quarter. Eight of them were threes. And the Celtics, again, it's all based on how the play develops. But 18 threes and eight twos is not what you want to see. No, not especially when you don't have a shot blocker out there on the other side. Second quarter underway. Miami with the ball. They've cut the 15-point deficit down to five. 26-21. Hawkins hounded by Hauser. Bounce pass for Kevin Love, left side, guarded by Tatum, who slides his feet, forces the cross-court pass to Duncan Robinson, wants to go to Hockett. They're just hunting Hauser every time down. Hockett, left-hand dribble drive, spins on Hauser, runs it off the glass and ends. Tough shot. Boston lead down to three. Reason you do, honey. You make, you make baskets. 26-23. As good as Hauser's been defensively, it's still the best option. If you're attacking Tatum against Duncan Robinson, there comes the double team bounce pass kick out. They swing around to find the open man. It's Hauser again. He knocks down the three. Ah, the open looks. He's a, I mean, they're going to, if you rotate the ball the right way, you're going to have wide open looks. Celtics by six, 29 23. Opening minute, quarter number two of game one. Hockey spins away from Pritchard. Tatum waiting for him. Hockey drives, spins it up crazy. No good, but an offensive rebound. Nobody boxed out Kevin Love, and he taps it in with one hand. 29-25. Holiday coming baseline. His bounce pass deflected out of bounds. Celtics will keep it plenty of time. 18 to shoot. Uh, Kevin Love always been a thorn in the Celtics side. This time just gets inside out. Scored a couple of baskets so far. Kevin Love, seven points so far early in this basketball game. Three Fasc- rebounds. Fascinating career he's had. Under out of bounds. Hauser with plenty of time. Doesn't force it up. They swing it around the horde to Holiday. Holiday, long cross court. This gives Hauser a much better look, and he knocks it down again. So, it, you know, Miami, it's so much pick your poison, but clearly they're saying, all right, Hauser, Holiday, Pritchard, you guys have to show us that you can make three. And when the Celtics do, it's going to be lights out. Boston by seven. Kevin Lowe, baseline extended against Drew Holiday, kick out, DeLong right, had a good look, didn't take it, puts it back in his pocket, one dribble drive, kick out, Highsmith, dribbles around, Hauser fumbles it, chases it down, moves it to Duncan Robinson, who can't even get a three away because Miami Offense. dribbled out the shot clock. Offensive call, they got, got a, a block in. That's even better for the Celtics. So it would have been a shot clock violation now throwing another foul on Highsmith, who's the guy that replaced Caleb Martin after he picked up two fouls. Celtics have only committed two fouls themselves in the first 14 minutes. And he also wants to take this crowd out of the game, which they have done a little bit with that slowing the Celtics down, making them guess on offense. Here comes the double team again on Tatum every time. Long cross court pressure touches into the corner for another Sam Hauser three. I'm just saying. Beat me if you can. Beat me if you can from these corners. You rotate, swing the ball, pass it, get the single, get the double, get the triple. Don't look for the home run. They said, all right, Sam, how's it? See if you can make him. He missed his first two in the first quarter. Now he's made three in a row, and the lead is back to double digits. 10.02 to go. First half of game one, Boston 35, Miami 25. On the Red MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. Now you'll save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile. 
So whether you're playing a game at home, yes, cool, or attending one live, no! you'll save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile at cox.com slash internet. Other restrictions apply. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. This Mother's Day, Josh Sellers invites you to call a mom in your life to show how much you love and appreciate her. When you call, mom will be entered for a chance to win a $12,000 experience. Go to joshsellers.com forward slash call your mom to leave a message and Josh Sellers will deliver it to mom on Mother's Day. No purchase necessary, void were prohibited or restricted. Open to U.S. residents 21 plus. Terms, conditions, and state exclusions apply. Contest ends 5 12 24. Subject to official rules available at joshsellers.com forward slash call your mom. Sponsor Deutsch Family Wine and Spirits, Stanford, Connecticut. Without the ones like you, who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you with professional-grade industrial supplies. Count on real-time product availability and fast delivery. Call, clickgranger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. The generative AI revolution is coming to your smartphone, and it's fueled by Micron Mobile Solutions. Generative AI applications use billions of parameters to translate your text into images. Micron Memory and Storage Solutions feed these parameters into generative AI models at light speed, turning your smartphone into a mobile creative workstation. See how Micron Innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. The Celtics play here at the Sports Hub. Boston by 10, 35-25, with 10.02 to go in the first half. Max's keys to game one brought to you by your local New England Honda dealer. Adventure more, worry less with the certified pre-owned Honda and Honda back benefits. Learn more at NewEnglandHondaDealers.com. If Miami has a hard time scoring the basketball, what I'm looking right now is how are they going to beat you? And that'll be second chance opportunities. I'm looking over there, one guy in particular, Kevin Love, who will do a job on you if you, you don't, don't you really put a body on him. You put a body on him, you get a better opportunity. Heat missed their first four shots since then. They are 11 of 18. And it's very clearly for Miami to win in the series, to win games, the games the Celtics are going to lose in the playoffs are going to be because they shoot it poorly. Shooting variance happens when you take as many threes as they do. And clearly, Miami has shown us in the first 14 minutes it's going to be, all right, we're going to take our chances and maybe we're going to get blown out of some of these games if you're going to make all these threes. But we have no choice. We're going to give you open threes, and we'll see if you can make it. Well, what we're going to do, we're going to take Tatum out of the game. We're going to take right. Brown out of the game. And what we're going to do is we're going to make oh, Sean Grant is worth ancillary guys beat them on that side. And one of the ancillary guys would probably be Hauser. And Pritchard and Hauser have 15 points already in game one. I got your ancillary right here. DeLon Wright playing the minutes that Terry Rozier would play. He fumbles the pass back from Bam Adebayo. Miami turns it over. Bam never really had that ball under control. Hauser diagonally for Pritchard. Oh. Tatum spins in the baseline, tries to put it up in the left-hand field in contact. Foul presumably by Tyler Hero, and Tatum will get free throws. Well, Bam comes over. Great move then by Tatum. Spinning away from the defender and used that big body of his, that long wingspan, to kick that ball up on the glass. He knew he was already being fouled. Longtime friends, AU against each other, and obviously inexorably linked because of that block in game one of the 2020 Eastern Conference Finals. Bam and Jason Tatum, whose first free throw bounces in. You know what I, I, I hate about the NBA now? Too many guys who knew each other and played against each other. I didn't know a guy at all other than Phil Four that I played against when I was coming up. Tatum gets the free throw. Celtics have scored eight straight. They push the lead up to 12, 37-25 with 9.39 to go in the first half. Yeah, it's funny how now all international players are the top players in the league, huh? Duncan Robinson bounce pass Ooh. his fam spinning in the paint, forces it off the glass and in. Sam's been good here. Eight points, three rebounds, 37-27. Celtics by 10. 
Drew Holiday, and to Tate, a pretty good look at a wing three, no good. Rebound, Peyton Pritchard. Offensive rebound, reverses it up, and he's been doing it all year long. Moses McPritchard. Moses McPritchard. Top offensive rebounder in the NBA for a player his size, and it wasn't even close. Boston by 12, 39, 27. Duncan Robinson turns the corner, falling away on his right, knocks down a three. He can do that. Getting over that pick there. You tried, you chased. Step late. He missed a gasp of one in game seven in Miami two years ago. When the Heat were coming back late. Tatum on the wing, long cross court. Hauser waiting, catch and shoot, another three. Good. Swing from left to right. Strong side, weak side. Wide open. Celtics are 10 of 23 from distance, and that is not sustainable for the Heat. Boston by 12. Duncan Robinson, chased by Pritchard, runs to his left, launches on the move, no good back iron, rebound Tatum. Tatum into the front court, Highsmith waiting for him. Going to move into the corner, Hauser thought about pulling the trigger, Bam has to close the distance on him, so the kick out, Holiday, that means Punch. Horford is alone in the paint, and he catches, floats it up, and in. Funny how it works, draw Bam out of the paint, good things happen. Mouse in the house, this time goes up softly. Celtics playing a really smart first half now. 44-30. Boston by 14. Tyler Hero down the right side. Getting dogged by Pritchard. Bounce pass for the cutter. Deflecting stolen for a second by Holiday. Can't hang on to it. Bam out of bio rips it away, but he misses his hook shot. And the Celtics have the rebound. Pritchard going strong on Tyler Hero. Gets onto the basket and then floats it all the way back out to Al Horford. Tatum straight away against Highsmith. Tatum on the prowl. Throws the shoulder into Highsmith at the elbow. Double team comes from Duncan Robinson. Tatum steps back away from it and his 14 footer is money. Too small. <laughs> Man gave the too small sign. Get him out of here. 17 to 5 as the Boston run. Celtics have their largest lead up by 16. 46 to 30. DeLon Wright deep on the left side. Push pass for Bam on the bio. He's alone, so he takes the three away short. That's a hope shot. Horford falls down as he gets the rebound, but he gets it away to Tatum. That's just not damn shot. Celtics plus seven on the glass. Tatum pump fake steps through on Highsmith. Feeling contact. Shot won't fall. He wanted it. But he'll go to the line and see how many free throws he's going to get. Gonna be two, right? Yeah, it's going to be two. Can see the fingers down. Yeah, we can't see from obviously our angle. Got him up and then just kind of. Oh, yeah, he, he brushed him. That was. I'd like to see that one again because look, he was behind the, behind the line. But. What do I know? All I know is that Bird, Parrish, Mikhail aren't coming in here. And yet all you, you did. All you fans. We thank you for your participation. This is called time. work. When I, oh, other, other, other guy, other day, what? the guy, I was someplace and the guy said something, you blame with the Southerners. Guy said, so thank you for your service. I'm like, well, I'm in the Army? <laughs> Say, I'm in Thank you for your service. Say that for Manny Maxwell, who was in the Marines. I just happened to play basketball. Well, I don't remember us any ever getting a weekend pass in 23 uh, years. That's true. Tatum gets the free throws, and methodically now, the Celtics on a 19-5 run have pushed the lead to 18. 48 to 30. Bam out of bio against Porzingis. Bumps him at the mid block. Draws the contact. The fall away shot is no good, but he lured Porzingis in and got himself some free throws. Should be the second on Porzingis. Just the third foul total against the Celtics here in the first half. You, you didn't trust me then? I gave you these two fingers. No, no. I was looking to see how many total fouls there were. I'm telling you about Porzingis. I knew it was Porzingis' second, but it made me curious. Trust. I don't believe you trust me. Is that for all the who are you and, and what you do with Sean Gray? For all of the <laughs> perimeter defense, ask me again later in a couple of months. Uh, for all of the perimeter defense, Celtics have played here. Not a single front backcourt player has picked up a foul for the Celtics. Peyton Pritchard comes out to the ovation. He's just a different dude right now. Yeah, he really is, man. I mean, and, and what are you going to say now about Brad Stevens? <laughs> Brad going up. Peyton Pritchard at $7 million a year. That might be a, that's a, a bargain in the NBA these days. Bam out of bounds, gets the free throws. Bam has 10, but the Heat trail by 16. 48 32 is the Boston lead. 6 48 to go in the first half. Home teams won all four game ones yesterday. We weren't really that close. The New York Philly game got interesting. Porzingis kick out Derek White. Here's the entry to Tatum. Hawkins with his back. Tatum at the right elbow pulls up. Clean look at a jumper switch. He won the end one. Hawkins hit him on the arm as he went through with that jump shot. That's why he, what he wanted. 
Chicken so, Van pick up another foul here. Celtics up to 51% shooting. Kick out. Hero for three. Bounces short. Rebound Tatum. I'm with you. Bam's got to go. Porzingis trying to get that third. Mm. Celtics have a chance to take a 20-point lead. They had 41 of them in the regular season. Tatum. Mismatch. Here's the entry. Porzingis turns on Hotchaz at the free throw line. Spins to his right. Falls away. Shot comes up short. He got hit. No call there either on the rebound for Tyler Hero. Bam into the front court. Derek White waiting for him. So the long lead pass for Caleb Martin. Where he's flat on that three and short. And the rebound for Tatum. Caleb could miss one of those last year. Holiday into the front court. Turns the corner on Hero. Double team on Holiday. So the kick out. Porzingis on the wing. Porzingis one dribble in on Bam out of bio. Hands back to Holiday. Two strides into the paint. Gets in deep. Runs it up. No good. He missed the layup. And Bam out of bio has the rebound. Too easy. Bam into the front court. Porzingis waiting for him at the elbow. Here's the pull-up jumper. That's going to bounce, and it was short. And Joe Mazzulla didn't like the momentum, the way things were going. He will call the timeout, even with oh, the he, size of a lead. He, he didn't call a timeout, Sean. He doesn't. 5.27 to go. First half of game one. Boston 50, Miami 34 on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics radio network. Now you can save on Cox Internet by adding Cox Mobile. So you can do everything you want, everywhere you want. Stream the big game with fiber-powered speeds at home. Or capture it courtside on your phone with unbeatable 5G reliability on the go. So you can do more without spending more. Learn how at cox.com slash internet. Cox Internet is connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Not all services and features available everywhere. Other restrictions apply. Your engine is dirtier than you think. As soon as it started for the first time, it begins building up engine killing deposits that dramatically impact longevity, fuel economy, and performance. And at Valvoline, preventing these damaging deposits isn't enough. We've revolutionized a way to completely reverse them. Introducing Valvoline Restore and Protect, the first and only motor oil that restores pistons to factory clean by removing up to 100% of deposits. That's right, 100%. This first-of-its-kind innovation restores engines to run like new. And the more you use it, the more it continually cleans inside your engine. Plus, Valvoline Restore and Protect is a premium full synthetic that provides 79% better wear protection than industry standards. It not only eliminates deposits, it prevents future deposits from forming. Restore your pistons to factory clean. With all new Restore and Protect, another first from Valvoline. At UMass Memorial Health, you can be a nurse, mental health clinician, medical assistant, but you can also be a after hours musician, family chef, t-ball coach. That's because we hire you, all of you, and treat you like a person, not a position, with great pay and excellent benefits like retirement savings plans and tuition assistance. Come be you at UMass Memorial Health. Explore all we offer at wehireyou.org. Listen live. Check out our podcast with the 98.5 The Sports Hub app. He is going five cents off per gallon with GoPay. Download the GoPay app today for the fast and convenient way to pay at the pump. Go proud to be the official fuel partner of the Boston Celtics, who are fueled on by a raucous crowd wow, to start game one. Did. So what you did, then. We, you weave it in. Yeah, you weave that in. We Fueling, get, and yeah, I got that. We get sponsor reads, and you got to weave it right I saw, in. I saw, I saw, I Come here. Slowly but surely. It's not my first day. No. Not mine either. For a while. Thank you for your service. <laughs> you know you're going. I know you're going to use. That. This is going to be an ongoing theme. John Grandy using something that a weight person, as he sits me down at the table and says, "Sir, who did you play for? Celtics. Thank you for your service." Hey, I'll go. Like I just came back from Vietnam or something. It's well, like really. I mean, probably some business, of those. Some of those storm. Some of those playoff games in Philadelphia probably. There was but they came with the born then. When they were born. All right, Celtics lead by 16. They were twice up by 18 with a chance to go up by 20, in which in this season of historical dominance and outrageous numbers, I'm not sure which one was my favorite. But how about the fact that the Celtics took 20-point leads in literally half of the games this year? In 41 games out of the 82, they had a 20-point lead. They very nearly had one in the first half of game one today. Out of the timeout, Celtics with a 16-point lead and the ball. It's 50-34. to 34. 
So Miami shot it pretty well, 47%, but not from distance. Derek White for Jason Tatum straight away. Swings to Jalen. Pretty good look at a three. It's online, but short. And the rebound for Bam is fifth to go along with 12 points. He's got 12. Hauser has 12. Tatum has the game high, 13. Tyler Hero. Push pass for Bam on a bio hand. Back to Hero. Off a curl. Bounce pass to Bam. Steps into the elbow and knocks down a jumper. They've been running that play for a while. And they run that with perfection. Four straight for Miami. Cuts it to 14, 50 to 36. Tatum catches, driving strong on Bam, feeling contact. Fall away is no good. And Bam's got the rebound again, his sixth. He is such a good defender. Hands off to Tyler Hero, steps to his right. Straight away three is no good. Rebound pinball the round. Chasing Jovic, he saves wow. it. Back into Caleb Martin. Wow, that looked like either he or the ball was going to go out of bounds. Jovic wants it back in the corner. Enters to Tyler Hero. Hero backs it out of the wing. Holiday will chase him. Bam sets the screen. Hero starts his drive, exposed the ball, and Tatum rips him off. Tatum running with Porzingis, going to keep it, lay it up and in. A lot of contact here. That was, uh, and, and what they're doing, trying to say it was a double team there. Close to it then with Tatum. Tatum's up to 15, 52-36. Celtics by 16, exactly four minutes remaining now in the first half. Hakez turns the corner, Derek White slides his feet. Hakez doesn't want to take the tough shot, so he kicks out to Caleb Martin. Bounce entry, bam against Porzingis. Baseline extended, gonna have to shoot it with two on a shot clock and his rainbow jumper, no good. Jalen flies in for the rebound. Miami not sending anybody after those offensive boards. Jalen lobs the entry to Holiday. Touch pass into the corner for a Derek White three that's short of the rebound for Jovic. Celtics have had good looks here from distance in the first half. Bam driving strong up, Porzingis runs it up. Blocked by Porzingis. Did Holiday save it off of Bam? We're waiting for the official signal. Bill Kennedy says no, that Holiday's attempt to throw it off Bam went out of bounds before it hit him. So did the ball hit the ground first or Bam first after Holiday threw it? Oh, no. That should be Ooh, challenge that one. I wanted to challenge that would be when I'm challenging. I'm not, uh, I'm not as confident what? as you. Well, be confident now. Yes. Very confident. No, I know. It hit the ground first. You weren't going to get that reversed. Turn to the corner, Tyler Hero, free throw line. Hangs in the air, kick out Jovic. Pretty good look at a wing three. Rims out, and the rebound for Tatum. Jovic has been hitting that shot this year. Tatum, shovel pass lead, bad one, and Jalen Brown can't handle it. And those are kind of the gasp turnovers you can't have in the playoffs. Yeah, can't be sloppy like that. You want to get every everyone you get out there, you want to make that, make sure you pay, make them pay. Uh, it's literally just the second turnover for the Celtics, both for Tatum, but that one shouldn't happen. Hawkins turns the corner, tiptoes under the basket, Porzingis waits for him the whole time. Kick out to the cutter. Jovic swarmed, gobbled up, shot was blocked, but they're calling a foul, and Jovic goes to the ground hard after getting hit. He'll get free throws here with Miami down 16. Well, Jovic made, made a great play. This time comes in again. Yeah. And Derek White went for the shot block and he kind of clipped Jovic on the back of the head. So Jovic will go to the free throw line as we take 10 seconds for station identification on the Bet MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. This is Boston's most listened to sports station. Boston's home for sports. Sports Hub. Easily media group station. Randy and Max at a sold out and then some TD Garden for the day everyone's been waiting for. It's like Christmas all over again. The opening game of the playoffs. Celtics with a 15 point lead. 52 37. Another free throw coming here for Jovic. 3 0 1 to go in the first half. Well, good thing this happened yesterday. The Bruins won. They look great against Toronto in game one. First free throw is good for Jovic. What was your favorite part? They won. <laughs> 52-38, Boston by 14. How about that Red Sox starting pitch? Porzingis drive, shut off at the free throw line, kick out. Peyton Pritchard back in the game. Pritchard, top of the circle, finds Porzingis. Pretty good looking at three, got it. That's crazy. I mean, you, you got a guy that close to you, and he's knocking it down easily. Caleb Martin switches hands. Porzingis comes out for challenge. Celtics by 17. Tyler Hero, hounded by Pritchard, return to Jovic. Jovic hand to Caleb Martin, short. leans into an ugly yeah. shot, it comes up short. He got caught in between shooting and passing. Porzingis hands the rebound to Derek White. Derek White in the front court, takes the dribble handoff to Jalen Brown, throws it back out to Tatum. 
Tatum watched by Jovic, angles to the right side of the floor, 11 of the shot clock. Tatum switching, left hand, right hand, left hand, right hand on the dribble, trying to put Jovic to sleep. Here's the step back and the three is a boulder. Rebound, Pritchard almost stole another one, but it gets to Tyler Hero. Bounce pass lead, Jovic, shovel for the cutter, and Hakez, he muscles it up, no good. Hakez clearly pushed off of that front arm because Porzingis was waiting, and he couldn't shoot it over. Jalen switches to the left hand, comes strong on Highsmith, goes off the glass, no good. Porzingis crashes, can't get the rebound. Here's Hakez the other way. Numbers going the other way. Hakez shovel pass back to Hero, clean looking three, nope. Rebound Porzingis, got to make those. Miami just two of 13 from distance. Celtics by 17 and the ball. They've got some things to clean up here, and they've still got the big lead. Made it 32 to go in the first half. Jalen Brown throws the shoulder in it's Tyler Hero. Double team from Hawkins. Kick out to Pritchard. Now Tatum straight away. He's looking at shot White clock. in the free throw line. Instead, three on the shot clock. He turns. Bounce pass from Porzingis, who gets the three away. No good. Long rebound. Highsmith has it for Miami. Highsmith head of the front court. Lead for Caleb Martin. He's alone, but Pritchard eventually closes the distance. Hawkins, bounce entry. Highsmith kick out open in the corner. Nobody near Tyler Hero, and he knocks down a three. Tyler Hero ain't missing all those. Margins. First three for Tyler Hero in four tries. Five tries, 55-41, Boston by 14. Final minute, first half of game one. Celtics led by 15 immediately, and that's pretty much where we've been most of the half. Derek White, full four straight straightaway three, got another one. That, that, that's almost unfair. The Celtics have made 12 threes, Miami's only made three. Peter lucky to only be down 17. 58-41. Two for one here for Miami with 35 seconds to go. Let's look at these margins here late in quarters. Kayla Martin steps away from Pritchard. Tough shot is good as he. We're going to call it a two for now. They'll look at it. Officials each signal something different. So they get the two for one. Seven second difference on the two clocks as we count it down in the first half. Boston by 15, 58 43. Derek White out near half court against Hotkins. Porzingis comes out, sets the screen. Four in a shot clock. Derek White starts his drive, pulls up at the elbow, leans in, and runs it home. Nine seconds left here for Miami, but in the backcourt, Tatum steps in front of Hakez and yeah. commits the foul. Obviously, he had the foul to give yeah. him. And Tatum had not committed a foul. So that gives Miami 7.9 to set something up here. And what, what Tatum actually did wasn't bad because he went for the steal. He didn't let the man go by him, hit him with the body, and now you kind of started all over. So nothing bad happened, but you did leave almost eight seconds on the clock. That's a lot of time. Porzingis hanging onto his hand. He got hit by Jovic. So they've let, I'll say this, they've let a lot of things go here. Hakez, five seconds across half court. Hakez driving on. Horford gets to the rim and scores. He got there so quick, he left three seconds on the clock. Holiday to half court, launches. Just short, and that's how the first half will come to an end. So an easy bucket for Miami in the final seconds. The Heat closed the second quarter strong, but only after a strong Celtics barrage to open the first and the second. Coming up, Matt Dondero scores. I'll tell you what's coming up later in the NBA. Day two of the Stanley Cup playoff. Red Sox trying to finish that sweep in Pittsburgh. I'll update you on all of it. Then back here at the Garden for the second half of game number one. Boston 60, Miami 45. Game one has reached halftime on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile, and the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time, there's Granger, offering professional-grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, click Granger.com, or just stop by. Granger, for the ones who get it done. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox Internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. Made the bed by Thuma, the perfect platform bed frame. Thoughtfully handcrafted from upcycled wood, the bed is strong, 
backed by a lifetime warranty and ships directly to your door. Assembly takes five minutes, no tools needed. To get $25 towards the bed, go to Thuma.co. That's T-H-U-M-A dot C-O to receive $25 off your purchase of the bed. Shop the bed at Thuma.co. The home of the ribs, the sports hub. Jalen Brown up the right side, drops the shoulder, spins oh on God. Hawkins, oh. drives and slams in two hands. Hawkins still looking around saying which way did he go. Oh my God, Hawkins. Where did he go? Boston Celtics in control at halftime, 60-45 the score. And that's exactly what you're looking for if you're the Celtics. They came out strong, quick 9-0 run. They got up by double digits early. Miami, as the Celtics, I'm sure, knew, scrap, claw, fight, doing what they can do to kind of hang around. But the Celtics in control of this game. Sort of everything going according to plan. They knew Miami would be... You know, up to the task as best they're capable of, but Boston doing what they can do and executing on all levels, really. Uh, despite a, a fast start for Jalen Brown, he finished with just five, five quick points, it feels like, and then he finished a half of five points, but he had help. Jason Tatum with 15 points, including this three-pointer right here. Rebound hits through Holiday. He's got the offensive board. Kick out Derek White. Shovels it to Tatum. He's going to try to three on Hawkins and stick it. And even when you take a bad shot, good things are happening. The Celtics are 7 of 9, and they've gotten offensive rebounds on both their misses. 17 to 2. Jason Tatum only 1 of 5 from 3. However, making great decisions, taking it to the rim, and really productive around the basket and making shots there. So... Um, the one of five hasn't hurt him. Four for four from the free, uh, from the free throw line. So, Jason Tatum featured doing what the Celtics need him to do. Kristaps Porzingis, he has 13 at the half and a very efficient three for five from distance. Big three by Pritchard. Turn the momentum. Now Pritchard going to drive. The overs there shut him off. Kick out and a bounce pass fielded by Porzingis for three. And that weapon that he has right now is crazy. Seven for the throwing darts, man. Nightmare for Miami. The first five threes of the series have been knocked down by the Celtics. And this is where the Celtics are at their best. You know, they got their other guys, their supplement, supplemental, complimentary players, whatever you want to call them. They're going. They're making shots. Peyton Pritchard made a couple uh, three-pointers. Pritchard in the first half, three of five, eight points, two of four from beyond the arc. He was very good. You know who was excellent in the first half? Four of six from three for 12 points is Sam Hauser. Hauser, for plenty of time, doesn't force it up. They swing it around the horn to Holiday. Holiday, long cross court. This gives Hauser a much better look, and he knocks it down again. So, it, you know, Miami, it's so much pick their poison, but clearly they're saying, all right, Hauser, Holiday, Pritchard, you guys have to show us that you can make three. Sam Hauser on a heater there in the first half. Um, a guy that was not hot in the first half for Miami was Tyler Hero. Five points. The Celtics have to assume he'll get going. He did hit a three right at the end of the first half. Bam out of bio, strong 14 points. Hero just one of five from three in that first half. A couple good looks, too. He just could not get it to drop. So the Celtics are going to have to monitor him. He's going to be looking to score with the Heat. Um, down 15 in the first half. It feels like it could have been a little bit more. It almost felt like a little bit more, but that little run at the end of the quarter help Miami keep it within distance. So we'll see how they do coming out of halftime when we come back here. The Celtics in control. We'll go, we'll get you updated. We'll give you the headlines here on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub, Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is connected to the premises via coaxial connection. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. 
Without the ones like you, who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you with professional grade industrial supplies. Count on real time product availability and fast delivery. Call clickgranger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. The generative AI revolution is coming to your smartphone, and it's fueled by Micron Mobile Solutions. Generative AI applications use billions of parameters to translate your text into images. Micron Memory and Storage Solutions feed these parameters into generative AI models at light speed, turning your smartphone into a mobile creative workstation. See how Micron Innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island Jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. When you're high, you feel different. Pretty obvious, right? You think different, talk different, but if you feel different, you drive different. So if you're high, just don't drive. Brought to you by NHTSA and the Ad Council. The only place to hear the game, the Sports Hub. Sports Hub Headlines. Boston Celtics playoff coverage is pre presented by Amica Insurance. As the Celtics chase Banner 18, visit amica.com today to learn more about Amica's award-winning customer service. Celtics in control at halftime. 60-45 over the Heat. Tatum with 15. Sam Hauser with 12 on four of six shooting from three. Meanwhile, another playoff action. The Boston Bruins dominated game one of their first round playoff matchup against the Toronto Maple Leafs yesterday. Five to one the final. Jeremy Swayman made 35 saves and Jake DeBrus scored two goals as the B secured the one zip series lead. Game two will be Monday night in Boston. Jim Montgomery not publicly yet stating who will be in net for the Bruins in game two. The Red Sox dismissed the Pittsburgh Pirates for the second straight game on Saturday, four to two. They're in action currently. Uh, in Pittsburgh going for the sweep and currently the score in Pittsburgh between the Red Sox and Pirates we have two to one Sox in the third inning go for the sweep there of the Pirates Tristan Cass is placed on the 10-day IL with a left rib strain and the Revolution dropped a game last night to Toronto one zip the final other games around the NBA later today getting set to tip off this afternoon will be game one between the Mavericks and the Clippers, that will be out in Los Angeles. The Pacers and Bucks tonight, they'll get their series underway 7 p.m., followed by late late night, 9.30 p.m., Pelicans at the Thunder for game one. When we get back, we'll go back to TD Garden for the second half and join Grandy and Max as the Celtics and Heat continue game one here on the BetMGM 98.5 The Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. When you find a deal on your favorite thing in the McDonald's app and order it, does that technically count as online shopping? Save money with the app. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. At participating McDonald's, prices may vary. Advertising is a race. No matter what products or services you're advertising, if your campaigns aren't winning, you might be left on the track. Stack Adapt. Speed that makes the difference. Learn more at stackadapt.com slash advertising. Nature has developed a lot of natural defenses. Take it from a little bug like me. I've pretty much seen them all. Porcupine's got quills. Snake's got venom. And me, I got camouflage. Nature's always finding ways to support life, like elderberries. Nature's Way extracted the best of the berry, tossed in vitamins C and D and zinc, and put them into a yummy immune-supporting gummy. Nature's Way Sambucus Gummies. Powerful immune support inspired by nature. Nature's Way. So, you've got an idea for a business. The store of your dreams. There's just one thing to figure out. Everything. That's why Shopify's all-in-one commerce platform makes it easy to sell online, in person, and everywhere else. Sell on social media? 
source products with an app to get that first sale feeling. It's the only solution that gives you everything you need to sell everywhere you want. So when you're ready to bring your idea to life, power it up with Shopify. Sign up for a $1 per month trial period at shopify.com slash listen. Backstagecountry.com, your online home for all things country music. Like most of us, Keith Urban also has a bucket list. You may be surprised to learn what is and is not on his. Text Keith to 45911 to read and learn more about the central theme of Keith's bucket list. Get a link to the story sent right to your phone when you text Keith to 45911. Go inside country music at backstagecountry.com. Felger and Naz, afternoons 2 to 6 on the Sports Hub. This is Reliving the Green. What a bat by DJ! 42 for Paul Pierce! A three-pointer for Danny A! KG is locked and loaded tonight. What a, a look back at this date in Celtics history. So the Celtics change the starting lineup, they change the rotation, and they change the course of this series. Celtics have forced a game five and have gotten right back into it. Your final score here at the United Center. Celtics 104, Bulls 87 in game number three. Some would suggest that the change was the injury to Rajon Rondo. Seven years ago today, the Celtics won game three of the first round series after losing the first two. Remember, they were the number one seed, one of the... Uh, shakiest resumes in terms of wins and scoring margin a number one seed has ever had then lost the first two games at home now isaiah thomas had lost his sister before that series began and they went down 0-2 that turned it around in game three then the celtics won game number four and of course it would actually win six games in a row the final four games of that series and the first two in the second round against washington already seven years ago today Today, game one of the Eastern Conference quarterfinals, Celtics with a 15-point lead. They've hit all of their benchmarks offensively despite a long drag late in that first quarter. What's interesting is that the Celtics offense basically went dead quiet for nearly nine minutes. And the first half's only 24 minutes long. And for nine minutes, the Celtics offense was non-existent. Yet they've got 60 points on the board and they made 12 threes. Well, and somebody just pointed out to me a minute ago saying, look at the stat line. I said, which one? He said, Tatum. 15 points, 8 rebounds, 6 assists. Man, headed towards a triple-double quickly. He's just controlling the game. And the Celtics are making Bam out of bio work. And Bam's going to put in work in this series, but he's going to need a lot more help than he had in that first half. 14 points, 6 rebounds for Bam. 15, 8, and 6, as you said, for Tatum. Porzingis had 13. A big swing is when Sam Hauser missed his first two threes, and we talked about that. Some mini slump he was in at the end of the year. Then he hit three in a row. Peyton Pritchard playing with that crazy confidence level, super high. And the Celtics bench, which is the reason that people at the start of the year were skeptical of them as a championship threat, has picked up where it left off in the regular year. Well, if you have Sam hitting those shots and you have Porzingis hitting those shots, those margins are absolutely crazy. Miami's clearly said we're taking the pain away. You're going to have to hit open threes. And the Celtics not shooting a crazy high percentage, but they've taken 30. 30 of their 48 shots were from three. And if the Celtics shoot 40% with that, they're going to win easily. Hawkes turns, drives, and scores to open the second half. The lead is 13. Hawkes has been really nice. I mean, some of these drives towards the basket seems to be unaffected right now by the crowd. And again, Miami winning the end of quarters and the start of the next one. This is now a 15-10. Five-point advantage for Miami over this stretch. Tatum step back, long two for the baseline. No good. Back tap offensive rebound by Porzingis. Derek White moves it to Jalen Brown. Return to Derek White. Up fakes on Hotkiss. Drives in. Throws it into the corner. Jalen catches, rises, and knocks down a three. Man, that was a pretty good job then by Porzingis. Get that basketball just to keep it alive. Just five points, five rebounds, a quiet first half for Jalen Brown, but now he knocks down the three to put Boston up by 16. Tyler Hero, push pass for Hawkins. Pretty good look at a three, no good. Barely takes the back iron. Holiday going to chase down the rebound. Holiday into the front court. There's Derek White behind him, waiting for Porzingis to set a screen. Now starts his dribble. Steps to his right. He's going to launch a three. Got it. The NBA leader in corner threes hits that one straight away. And the Boston lead is quickly up to 19. 66-47. Hawkins, left-hand dribble. Jalen stays with him. Kick out Kayla Martin. Swung on the wing. Waiting Bam on a bio. His three is no good. Rebound Jason Tatum. And the Celtics could take that 20-point lead now. Tatum, trail three. No good. Wide right. 
third time the Celtics have had a chance to take a 20-point lead. Third time they have failed. Hotkins. Hand off Tyler Hero. Oh, straight oh. away three. Blocked by Jalen Brown. Loose ball. Knocked out of bounds by Bam out of bio. It'll be Boston ball. Nope. Oh, Bill Kennedy. Yeah, he's pointing the other way. He's getting everybody confused. Poor thing stop for a second. I don't know. It's our ball, right? Celtics have it up by 19. Holiday. Switches to the left hand. Chase into the corner. By Tyler Hero, kick out of the wing. Porzingis three, no good. Rebound, Jalen Brown back taps it. Runs to the corner, finds Tatum. He is wide open on the wing. Three, though, is flat and no good. And for five times now, the Celtics have had a chance to go up by 20, and five times they have not. Hakez. Bounce pass deflected by Holiday out of bounds. He will keep it with 14 to shoot. I mean, I, I look at Holiday. Dude's like an octopus, man. I mean, his hands are so quick. They're all over the place, knocking the basketball away. He gets on you. He's on you. Bam, straight away. Finds Haquez. Haquez in the paint, steps back and scores. Tough shot over Porzingis. Haquez not affected. Again, by the pressure the Celtics are putting on him. He hasn't been affected as a rookie all year. He's clearly headed for the all-rookie team, obviously, in the year with. I mean, he looked like a grown man. All that beard and everything going. With, with Wemby and Holmgren, obviously, he wasn't going to be top three. cross court pass. Hawkins deflects it, but Derek White is able to chase it out of the logo. Hawkins really dogging it here. 11 wow. on the shot clock, but Bam tries to fight through the poor single screen. He commits the foul. Hawkins is the only one up on you. Got a chance to see your guy a minute ago in the back. Pat Riley. I said, is that Mr. Riley? Didn't he throw his hand? He just kept walking and said, Max, I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> you know, Alonzo Morning here representing the Heat. Three minutes into the third quarter. Derek White steps to his right. He gives himself a short. pretty good look, but a three is short of the rebound for Tyler Hero. So the Celtics now six chances to go up by 20. Jovic the other way. Misses a three. Long rebound. He's going to get to it. Hakez will. To the basketball. Hakez floats it out to Jovic. Jovic for three. Got it. That will be quick to that basketball. Just, uh, you don't react once the ball hits the rim. Lead is 14, 66, 52. 8.33 to go in the third. Is that that wrong up there? Porzingis bounce pass, trying to get it to Jalen. He's in behind Jovic, but he can't handle the pass. Out of bounds it goes. There come the Heat again. Hakez racing into the front court. Runs it up and in. Uh, he did that at the end of the second quarter, and he does it here. Miami's run off seven straight, and they've cut it to 12. 66-54. Don't ever think Miami's going to stop fighting. It won't happen. Derek White floats it towards Porzingis. Deflected and stolen by Hakez. Hakez goes behind the back of the bounce pass for Jovic. Out of the corner, Hero runs into Porzingis and loses the ball. Tyler Hero tried to get tricky with a dribble and lost it to Porzingis. Derek White for Holiday on the wing. Now Tatum straight away trying to calm it down. Get to that ramp, man. Tatum finds Porzingis. Push pass for Derek White. He's going to drive into the mid block. Kick out Tatum coming strong through the paint. Lays it up and in. You were saying? Get to the rim. Layup opportunities are there. Bam is not blocking shots. Tatum has only scored this afternoon when the Celtics needed the bucket. 17 9 and 6 for Tatum. 68-54. Hakez, bodied by Jalen Brown. Turns to the free throw line, falls away. Tough shot, no good. He, he's game, there's no yeah, doubt, but he's taking tough shots. Derek White or Tatum straight away against Bam. One dribble in, kick out Derek White. Right side three, swish. Tatum's got it back under control. Time out, Eric Spolster. Tatum, Tatum might get that triple-double. He's good. He might get it soon. 17 9 and 7 for Tatum and the Celtics lead by 17 705 to go third quarter of game one Boston 71 Miami 54 on the bed MGM 98.5 the sports hub Celtics radio network how powerful is Cox internet powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas Phoenix and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile and the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time. 
there's Granger, offering professional grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, clickgranger.com, or just stop by. Granger, for the ones who get it done. When you find a deal on your favorite thing in the McDonald's app and order it, does that technically count as online shopping? Save money with the app. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. At participating McDonald's, prices may vary. At UMass Memorial Health, you can be a nurse, mental health clinician, medical assistant, but you can also be a after-hours musician, family chef, t-ball coach. That's because we hire you, all of you, and treat you like a person, not a position, with great pay and excellent benefits, like retirement savings plans and tuition assistance. Come be you at UMass Memorial Health. Explore all we offer at wehireyou.org. Does your money work hard for you? Earn more with an e-checking account from Westerly Community Credit Union. Get a crazy high interest rate, plus there's no monthly fee, no minimum balances, and you get up to $20 each month in free ATMs. Visit us online at westerlyccu.com slash e-checking or visit one of our branches to open an account today. The home of the bees, the sports hub. So the pattern has been Miami figures something out, throws a monkey wrench into the Celtics offense, and then they scratch and claw and start getting trying to get back in the game. And then Jason Tatum says, "No, no, yeah. this is what this is what we're going to do." And this is a game where he hasn't made necessarily spectacular plays, but have no illusions about. The sacrificing that everybody made throughout the course of the year, but maybe no one more than Jason Tatum, who could have been one of the top one or two guys for MVP. He's not going to this year, and that's the sacrifice he made. But you watch him on this big stage today, and he has been the best player on the floor. 17 points, 9 rebounds, 7 assists. Celtics up by 17 midway through the third. Yeah. Oh, come on, lady. Oh, that was... I, I've seen things as she well. She had the Celtics logo painted on the baby bump that she was displaying. That, you know, later on in life, that you know, you're gonna have to explain this to your child, because some, you know, somebody took a picture of that. I, well, you know what? I'm gonna step on the limb you, here. Years from now, that kid's gonna be in a Sam Adams commercial. What are you talking? Well, about? well, I, I'm gonna step on the limb here. This is one of the things that happened to me. I was actually at Wendy's autograph signing. One woman walks up to me with what these two seats it used to be in the old garden, and, and she says, "These are special." I'm like, "Why?" She said. My kids were conceived in it. All right, All right. Come on really? now. She, that's what she's saying. I'm not, not making it up. Well, wherever and however you're enjoying today's broadcast, <laughs> it's, it's Sunday. Knock Sean. yourself out. <laughs> 71 Don't do 54. That. Uh -uh. Celtics by 17. Tyler Hero push pass back for Hawkins. He's looking Caleb Martin's way. They run away from Martin, so he's all alone. Aims a three, and it's flat and no good. That has it in my Porzingis just deflects it, and he deflected it right to Caleb Martin, who misses again. Holiday gathers it up. Porzingis has got to grab these rebounds. Caleb could not miss those last year. He couldn't. The two guys in his face. Derek White for Porzingis. Puts it to the floor. Gets inside the free throw line. Bounce pass to Holiday. Can he come up with it? Under the basket, he can. Throws it back out of the wing where Jalen Brown is waiting for three. And there is your 20-point lead. Good job by Holiday to grab that basketball, bring it into his body, and make things happen on the right side. Hawkins is the only one right now aggressively looking for his shot. Tyler Hero bounce pass into the corner. Jovic quick three is no good. Rebound on the weak side is number 10 for Jason Tatum. He's three assists away from a triple double. He won't get it here because Derek White makes the extra pass to Jalen Brown, but he wasn't in an alley oop position, so he throws it back out to Porzingis. Jalen has it on the wing against Jovic. Dribbles to the right corner, puts it in the left hand. Now tries to put him to sleep. Step back three. Rims out. Rebound. Holiday offensively. Finally got a bounce. He throws it off Martin, and the Celtics will retain possession. Holiday being up. He's not scoring the basketball as much, but being the animal controlling the initial point of attack. Six points, five rebounds, four assists for Drew Holiday. Celtics a 20-point lead with 538 to go in the third. And you think about it, your guards, Derek White or White, have not really just, you know, knocked, knocked shots down. 
Under out of bounds, Tatum blobs it all the way out to Porzingis. Here's the handoff to Drew Holiday. Against Tyler Hero straight away. Tatum sets a little slip screen. Holiday finds Tatum left side against Caleb Martin. Tatum enters to Holiday, diving to the basket, flips it up, and the shot clock buzzer it rims out. Hook shot. Yeah, a little baby hook in the paint over Jovic. Jovic has the rebound. Here's Hakez. Hakez in his playoff debut. Has not looked out of place, that is for sure. Tyler Hero for Bam. Hand back to Tyler Hero. Return to Bam at the free throw line. Makes the extra pass on the wing to Caleb Martin. Stepping in on Tatum's and he doesn't want to shoot the three anymore. Hand off Hero over the shoulder pass. Caleb Martin doesn't want to shoot. Jovic does. He finds him and Jovic knocks it down. They did milk that clock. They rotated it, got it around to the right person. Nicely done. Well, I'm telling you right now, Caleb Martin already now doesn't want to shoot, and he's going to have to. 74 57, Boston by 17. 444 to go in the third. Holiday gets in deep on Hero, floats it up no good. He was off balance, looking for contact, didn't get the call. There are a few fouls called in this game, particularly in shooting situations. Hakez, bounce pass to the baseline. Caleb Martin, in trouble with the dribble, so he will control it and back it out on the wing. Caleb Martin, bounce entry to Bam against Al Horford. Seven on the shot clock. First time we've seen this matchup. Bam turns, draws a double from Porzingis. Kick out, they swing around to Hero. Return to Martin, one on the shot clock. He throws it to Hakez because he doesn't want to shoot. And it's a shot clock violation. Well, and let me see what Sprocher does here. Who's he get? Wow, he gets Hero instead. Well, Tyler Hero's not been good today at all. Band's been good, Hakez been good. Jovic has done what he's done most of the year. Jokic, yeah, he's been good. But I would say, looking at Hakez, he's the most aggressive Miami Heat player out there offensively. 74-57, Boston by 17, 411 to go in the third. Tatum, cross court, Horford, quick three straight away, rims out and the rebound. It's just not, it, it, although the Celtics are leading the way they are, it's just still just like moments away from being just brilliant. Hawkins, three over, Al Horford is no good, the rebound for Jalen Brown. How can, how can Hawkins see sometimes with that hair flopping in his, his eyes? Celtics plus seven on the glass. He had a bunch of offensive rebounds early. If you're just joining us, here's another foul away from the ball. Porzingis gets hit by Jovic, who will step through to argue the call. That's the second team foul in Miami. If you're joining us late, I mean, it's the playoffs. We're worried, number one. But number two, Celtics came storming out of the gates. They scored the first 14 points. They led 17 to two. And then Miami kept them quiet for about nine minutes, cut a 15 point deficit down to three. And then the Celtics started knocking down a bunch of threes, most notably Hauser in that stretch. Jason Tatum comes out. And I think people here have a true appreciation for the way that Jason Tatum has game one in the palm of his hand right now. Huh? This is it. Guy pointed out about the stat line. Drew Holiday. Straight away against Jovic. Brings the back of the wing to Jalen Brown. Jab step on Jovic, trying to get him to commit. Return to Porzingis. He up fakes the three. Okay. Steps to no, his left no, away no. from Hawkins. On no, the move, no. he hits a three. No, the shot no, 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 no. Get in the house right now. 11-3 Boston run. They made 17 threes here in game one. They lead by 20. Kevin Love. For Jovic. So unfair. Right hand dribble coming strong against Porzingis. Runs it up no good. Porzingis has done his job defensively. Four for the rebound. Here comes Jalen Brown. Celtics had their largest lead and the ball with three minutes remaining in the third right now. Jalen for Horford. Another three. Timeout coming. Yep. Eric Spolstra and the Miami coaching staff said our only chance here is for the Celtics to miss threes. They have it in game one. 2.58 to go in the third quarter. Boston 80, Miami 57 on the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. 
Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. Cuando fumo marihuana, me pierdo en la música. Me enfoco en cada instrumento. El bajo rítmico, las armonías del piano, la melodía contagiosa. Hey, amor, cuidado, hay alguien cruzando la calle. Sorry, no lo vi. Si te sientes diferente, conduces diferente. No conduzcas bajo los efectos de marihuana. Es peligroso y es ilegal en todas partes. Un mensaje de Nitsa y de Ad Council. Meet the Bed by Thuma, the perfect platform bed frame. Thoughtfully handcrafted from upcycled wood, the bed is strong, backed by a lifetime warranty, and ships directly to your door. Assembly takes five minutes, no tools needed. To get $25 towards the bed, go to Thuma.co. That's T-H-U-M-A dot C-O to receive $25 off your purchase of the bed. Shop the bed at Thuma.co. For the ones who work hard to ensure their crew can always go the extra mile, and the ones who get in early so everyone can go home on time, there's Granger. Offering professional grade supplies backed by product experts so you can quickly and easily find what you need. Plus, you can count on access to a committed team ready to go the extra mile for you. Call, clickgranger.com, or just stop by. Granger, for the ones who get it done. Connect with Boston's home for sports online. 985thesportshub.com. You can score five cents off per gallon with GoPay. Download the GoPay app today for the fast and convenient way to pay out the pump. Go proud to be the official fuel partner of the Boston Celtics. We will reconvene here on Wednesday night at 6.30 for game number two of the Eastern Conference quarterfinals. Celtics with a 23-point lead right now, late in third quarter of game one, 80-57. to 57. Uh -oh. And I was thinking today as, you know, my son paranoid because of my hammy, right? And he's been through, he's old enough now to have experienced his losses to Miami, so he's you know, overly concerned about this first round series. And all I said today to the family was, if the Celtics are going to lose a game in the series, I'm sure they will. Not today, because this is the longest gap between game one and game two. There is more talk show room per capita between now and game, the start of game two. It would be three full days of I got absolute some, I guess some, dumpster fire. Something just came through as soon as I get a foul here. Hot kids. Out of the timeout, Haywood Highsmith back out there for Miami. Highsmith has it here against Porzingis. Oh, what a difference Porzingis has made here. Jovic kick out. Hakez going to drive on Peyton Pritchard. Gets into the paint. Pass deflected, but it gets to Kevin Love. His three is no good. Late in the shot clock. Derek White deflects the rebound to Peyton Pritchard. Celtics have a chance to take a 25-point lead here on this possession. Porzingis. Or Peyton Pritchard. Right hand dribble turns the corner on Jovic. Kick out. Derek White moves to his left away from Hakez. Attacks the mid block. Slips it up with the right hand. No good, but he's fouled. And Derek White will get free throws. Uh, just came through here breaking news. Amazon. Taylor Swift's album just came out. It's available. Um, hello, Grandpa. But she's been dropping tracks on social media for the last several days. Hello. Duh. Thank you very much, John. <laughs> We are like, never, we are like, never oh, getting back together. Oh, 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 oh Taylor, this is a well. <laughs> You really? I like how she did it, though. I like how she came at the the award circuit. Like, Guys, I have some news I want to share with you. Guess what? I, I'm dropping my album. It's like, see him, girl. You, you have no shame. It's a franchise, man. I, I understand, but you, do you have to do it in, the, in an award show, Sean? Really? Well, luckily. With the extension, Peyton Pritchard get the extension. Drew Holiday just got now. Drew joins Jalen Brown as two guys in our work office that can afford tickets to see Taylor Swift. Oh, oh. Derek nice. White gets the free throws, and the Celtics now have a 25-point game, one lead, 82-57 or 2:13 to go in the first half. Ball got knocked out of bounds, and they may challenge. They're giving it to Miami. Celtics bench is talking about challenging here. Matt Reynolds is saying, "Do it, do it." As you can read his lips. He's saying, "Do it, do it." Joe Mazzulla's thinking about it. Yeah, and Joe Mazzulla's like, yes, Josh Tibble went over and said, you, you really want to challenge? Joe Mazzulla's like, yeah, yeah, I want to challenge. Wow. Yeah. I mean, his players were adamant about it. They were looking at Joe in the face like a like a father who was passing by Burger King. Stop, stop, stop. Or, stop. Or, the out of or, on the floor. in our parlance, in our time, in our travels, Kevin Garnett passing checkers. 
in Atlanta. True. Begging the bus to can't, stop. Can't. Can't say that. That's, that's true. Is he every time we see a check? It's, it's yo, 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 bus drop. yo, bus drop. It's yo, on me. It's on me. Yeah, yo, it's on me. Checkers, checkers Suck. on three, man. It's like really. Nutrition's come a little bit in the last few I, several I, years. I, and one of the stories that you know nobody w was untold during Kobe when Kobe's passing away, the Celtics end up uh, going to the ceremony. I went to the ceremony. I thought I was going to have bad seats. Ashley gave me a great seat. I was sitting right behind Bill Russell, so that's why I knew it was a great seat. But after that ceremony, we were going back in to the and hotel. Out, and, the ball is being awarded to Boston. Challenge is yeah. successful. The, the players hijacked the bus and went to in and out It's like, hey man, I, I thought we were talking about nutri nutrition. Let me, let me do like, like Iverson again. We're talking about nutrition, right? Nutrition, in not, and out? Not a meal, not no, a full uh, uh, meal. Yeah, we, we're, we're not talking about, you know, one of the green salad places you like, uh-uh. We're talking about, you know, sweet greens and that. We're talking about checkers or uh, in and out burger. The Celtics win the challenge. So it was only about 70% on the year in the regular season on challenges. Matt Reynolds said, uh, Matt Reynolds was, again, you used the word adamant. His eyes were bright. He's, you can read his lips. He's saying, do it, do it. Two minutes to go in the third. Celtics by 25. Porzingis kick out. Derek White up fake, steps to the right elbow. His jumper is true. And the route is on. Sam Cassell loved that play because it's in and out, kick out, and gets the ball to the shooter. Like the burger place. 84 57. You are working. We don't even sponsor those dudes. Jovic steps back away from Porzingis, misses the three. Al Horford grabs the rebound. Miami 5 of 26 from three. The Celtics 18 of 42. Jalen Brown creeps into the mid block, steps through Duncan Robinson, drop back to Porzingis. Pretty good look at 17. Jumper's no good. A little bit flat of the rebound for Duncan Robinson. Haywood Highsmith head of the front court for Miami. Heat with a blowout of Chicago Friday night to earn this first round series. Highsmith sets himself for a straightaway three. It's short, a rebound for Peyton Pritchard. Quite low with that dude. Rebounds basketball. Pritchard switches to the left hand, finds Jalen, slashes oh. the paint. Euro step floats it up. Oh, oh, oh. oh. sidestep the brother. That was walking back in the 80s, but now. Could play. It was a 12-point game early in the third quarter. It is no longer a 12-point game. Celtics by 29. Give me that. Delon Wright just gobbled up, swallowed whole by Porzingis, who comes up with the block and the ball. Celtics a chance to take a 30-point lead now. Jalen Brown, right-hand dribble in the paint as he jumps into the paint, reaching out as Jovic to tie him up for a jump ball. Being precise. Being this is what you have to do if you're playing the game the right way. The Celtics played it the right way for 64 wins in the regular season. And, and, and what means the most is playing it right now. Oh. Jalen wins the jump ball from the bigger Jovic. Derek White forces a three, sticks it. And the Celtics, who ran through the entire regular season and boat raced the lead, building 20-point leads and 30-point leads and beyond, have opened the playoffs the exact same way. 31.9 to go in the third quarter. Boston by 32. <laughs> A can of, of whoop behind. That's what that's called. Whoop ashes. Of all of the insane stats, this one might have been my favorite through this Rembrandt of a regular season. The Celtics took more 30-point leads than they had 10-point deficits. And here, in the opening playoff game, they have gone wire to wire and lead by 32 late in the third. Well, everybody has said before, Sean, one thing, you know, whoa, Sean, you can't say that because, you know, they, they haven't won those games. They haven't played in the playoffs. And I'm like, everybody else told me, like, where are you going to go? What are you going to do now? This is the opening salvo if you're the Boston Celtics. Come out, be aggressive, look to win the game, and then get ready for the next one. And the narrative for the next three days, and rightly so, is going to be if the Celtics win today by 50 and lose Wednesday by one, Miami's done everything yeah, they need absolutely. to do. Absolutely. That's the way of it. But all you can do is all you can do. And this team 
dominated the regular season the way none of the greatest Celtic teams ever dominated in 82 games. That's whoa, what whoa, happened. Whoa, whoa. I just talked to the big boys the other day. The big four were here. Yeah, down at Dick's Sporting Goods. And you went through a regular season winning games by 11 and a half points per game win. And that's why we had thousands of people who were there trying to get autographs from, well, not me, but Larry Bird. <laughs> Just happened and to be one there. day, very possibly, the 2024 Celtics will reunite somewhere, and there'll be a big line for that. So let's enjoy these moments as they're happening. Game one has turned into game 83 of the season for the Celtics. More things change, they don't. Duncan Robinson. To Bam, this is a pretty good game for Bam. Kevin Love double team return to Bam, floats it from 14 feet up and in. Down by 32 as we make the turn for home. End of three. In game one, Boston 91, Miami 59. On the bed MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub, Celtics Radio Network. Mass Mutual knows that finances can lead to uncomfortable conversations. We should talk about our finances. Sure. How about Friday evening? Soccer practice. Saturday morning? Soccer game. Maybe Wednesday night? Girls night. How about Thursday? Mm, guys night. Let me see your phone. So next time we're both free is three months from now. According to Calendar.com, the average American schedules less than four and a half hours a year for finances. Your finances deserve more. Go to MassMutual.com today. Feel comfortable about tomorrow. Now you'll save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile. So whether you're playing a game at home, yes, cool, or attending one live, no! you'll save on Cox Internet when you add Cox Mobile at cox.com slash internet. Other restrictions apply. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at Car Star. Explore the endless possibilities and visit carstarjobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's carstarjobs.com. Start your journey with us today. Backstagecountry.com, your online home for all things country music. Picking five of Carrie Underwood's best music videos was no easy task. But after some debate, we landed on five we believe rise to the top. Did Carrie's 2014 hit, Something in the Water, make our top five? Find out when you text Carrie to 45911 and scroll through the list on BackstageCountry.com. Text Carrie to 45911 to get your eyes on our favorite Carrie Underwood music videos. The Celtics play here at the Sports Hub. Catches law to England's injury attorney since 1986 and won over $2 billion for their clients. When you're injured, you can't work. Turn to Catches Law, no fee unless you win. Go to CatchesLaw.com to schedule your free consultation today. Nice hand for Mike Gorman showing his 2008 championship ring. And by the way, just that ovation because everyone's so ready to pop. Can you imagine if your guys from yesterday had shown up here? Yeah, they were the Larry Bird, they showed up here. It would show the roof out this building. Now, we've had big ovations for Donnie Wahlberg and Mike Gorman. And now the biggest one of all for a little kid pumping his fist. So, everybody here is just... The people that did show up with any fear or trepidation, obviously, this is the kind of day that makes that go away. Celtics by 32 as we begin the fourth. Well, I think you've been Celtics right now. You... You level off this momentum and get ready for the next game. And, and you make sure you finish this one health-wise, stay up, stay alert. And as you said before, Sean, doesn't make any difference. Win by 30, if the Heat come in and steal one, they've done their jobs. And it'll be really interesting to see what Miami comes up with over the next couple of days, because obviously, and it maybe this is the right strategy. Force the Celtics to shoot threes and hope they miss, but today they did not miss. <laughs> Keep firing your guns. Tatum. Cross court, Al Horford, Miami showing some zone here. Al Horford, nice through it, gets the mid block, runs it off the window and in. That's what you do against the zone. Yeah, just, well, normally you don't. You don't dribble through a zone. 
you, you pass it through his zone, but this time Al just dribbled through the zone. And that shows you how weak and ineffective the zone it is. It didn't collapse on him yeah. at all. He just had one smaller guy to beat. 93-59, Celtics have pushed the lead to 34. The Pritchard right now, locked up right now. With Kevin Love, and here's another steal. Highsmith and Duncan Robinson crisscross, and Hauser came up with a loose ball. Derek White into the offensive end against DeLon Wright. Cross court pass deflected by Wright. Pinballed around. Kevin Love has it. Derek White turns it over. High Smith leads for DeLon Wright. Sets himself for a corner three and hits it. Then you always know about the Heat. They're still going to compete. And the only question for Joe Mazzula now, Porzingis is probably done for the day. And when can you get Jason Tatum out of there? He and Derek White are the two starters on the floor here as we begin the fourth. Celtics leading by... 31, 93, 62. How about a three for Al Horford? How about yes? Miami's have to look at that play. Both guys are going with Tatum. They're leaving Al Horford wide open with that little brush pick. Celtics now 20 of 44 from distance. They had a 34-point lead in Miami on January 25th. They have one again here. That game as Tatum fouls Bam. Was he behind the line when he fouled him? No. No. I was saying, was they, were they going to count the Duncan Robinson shot, but the foul came way before it. Sean, here's one of the things that happened. You think about that Kobe Bryant Olympic experience where he ran through the, the chest of Paul, Paul Gasol yeah. and said, no, that's your buddy. You're not going to do that. Tatum, same way here. Yep. Duncan Robinson for Bam. Top of the circle. Hand off to Lon Wright. Pretty good look. Sets himself. Knocks down another three. So back-to-back -back threes for the Lon Wright. Miami had been 5 of 28 from distance in the first three quarters. Now DeLon Wright is at two in a row. We're at 96-65. Boston by 31 with 9.54 to go. That game, and Derek White lost it. DeLon Wright punched it away. Another Derek White turnover. Duncan Robinson for DeLon Wright. He is open again. Three again. Three in a row for DeLon Wright. 96-68. Nine thirty-five to go. It's just a matter of how long you can keep guys in the game. You don't want them to necessarily have out there. Bam comes out to challenge Tatum. Tries to spin away from him. Drive strong and is fouled on the way in. He decided to bounce here for the Celtics. So that game on January 25th when the Celtics also led by 34. That was the fourth most efficient offensive game in Celtics history. And while Miami has been the number one defense in the NBA since February 1st, that game was the worst defensive game in Miami Heat's franchise history. That's how efficient the Celtics were on that Thursday night down there. Derek White, skip pass into the corner. Hauser, left-hand dribble drive into the paint. Throws back out Derek White. Final seconds of the shot clock, and his three is right down in the middle. And now, Miami's getting into the three-point contest, and you can't do that once you're down by 30. Well, you can. It just ain't going in well. He's still going to be down by 30. 99, 68, nine minutes to go. Bounce pass to the back door cut. Highsmith guarded by Hauser. So he throws it back out to Kevin Love. Tatum still on him. Tatum still defending like it's the opening minute. Lob pass. Great pass from Kevin Love to Duncan Robinson. Got in behind Derek White for the easy two. Eight to three run for Miami. But they still trail by 29 with 8.41 to go. Tatum. Let's pick I, again. Two men going. Tatum, Al wide open. Tatum, one assist away from a triple double here. Starts his drive with the left hand, fumbles it, and lost it. Pritchard, though, going to save it. Shot clock winding down. He takes the fade away from the baseline, hits the rim, but it's no good. Kevin Love has the rebound. Margin is 29 right now with 8.18 to go. Bam on a bio, hand to Duncan Robinson. Bounce pass in the corner to Highsmith. Derek White got picked off after the crowd was reacting to. Highsmith, left hand dribble coming into the paint. Turn, gobbled up by Hauser, moves it down low to Kevin Love. He dropped it, but they're saying Tatum fouled him. Oh, Derek White got wiped out, man. That was a hockey play. Oh, and, Bam, and Bam moved when he did that. Yeah, that was, a, that was a hockey play. That was a goo that came in and got it. Yeah, we missed that one. Yeah, Bam stepped to his left, which you can't do. I mean, again, you can do it, and he got away with it. I would say for the most part, a lot of stuff let go on both sides here. Highsmith from the corner, misses the three. Rebound of the weak side for Peyton Pritchard, and now Joe Mazzullo will so grab late. the timeout. Eight minutes, three seconds remaining in game one. Boston 99, Miami 70 on the Red MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? 
powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox Internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com slash loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. Spin your passion into a business with Shopify and break sales records with the world's best converting checkout. Let's hear that one more time. The world's best converting checkout. Shopify's legendary checkout makes it easier for customers to shop on your website, across social media, and everywhere in between. Now that's music to your ears. Any way you spin it, you can be a smash hit with Shopify. Start your dollar a month trial today at shopify.com slash records. Listen live. Check out our podcast with the 98.5 The Sports Hub app. Pretty interesting when you think about it. The Celtics have taken 45 of their 73 shots from three. As you catalog them in your mind, how many of them were contested? Truly contested. Yeah, a lot of them were wide open looks, and that's because you're saying, and just like Miami's coach has said, I said, we can't guard these guys on one-on-one. -on -one. What we're going to do is we're going to junk it up. We're going to play zone all over the place. If the Celtics are able to rotate and get the ball to the right people and they make the shots, we're going to live with that. Now that they might have to change that strategy after this game. That is 62%, by the way. So five out of every eight shots the Celtics have taken in game one has been a three, but they made two out of those five. And that is and even better than that. They're up to 47% now, 21 to 45. And here's one of those games where, yeah, it could be a lot closer. But even if the Celtics were 14 of 45, which would be a bad shooting night, they'd still be leading this game. Well, the Celtics have done what they need to do early in this early in this series. You you want to go in and protect home court advantage. And very simply, if the math is done the right way, if the Celtics don't lose another home game, they win the championship. Same as 2008. When the Celtics now, had the best record in the NBA. But as you said before, you start looking back and you look last year, last couple of years, you're going, okay, Celtics record not as good. And here's the thing. The 2024 Miami Heat, obviously without Jimmy Butler, that changed it. But they are much better than they were last year as far as the regular season. And they're a heck of a lot better than the 2008 Atlanta Hawks. That is for sure. We took the Celtics to seven games in the first round. Tatum pull up from the free throw line jump was good everything he's needed to do he has not shot the three well in game one but he's six of nine inside the three-point line he's one assist away from a game one triple double Celtics lead 101 to 70 Boy. bam at the elbow nowhere to go throws the bounce pass all the way out to the lawn right Right, left-hand dribble coming strong, gets in too deep, throws it out of the wing. Hero catches, shoots on the move, and knocks down a three. Tyler Hero essentially have been out of this game. Yeah. First time he's really done anything. That was a Tyler Hero type shot, but it comes when Miami was down by 31. So we're at 101 73 now with 708 to go. Game two Wednesday night. The series will shift to Miami for game Saturday and Monday. Same play, I sold again. Tatum lost the ball, has it back, draws a double team, throws it away. Hero knocks it loose, but Pritchard wins the race to loose ball. He's at half court, so he has to launch. Looking for the rim, he didn't get it. So it's a shot clock violation. 24 second violation, Miami Wall. Tatum can't get into the dribbling because the double team is going to come. They're going to try to be effective, come on the backside, the offside, and attack him. Now, Southern's back in with their sudden lineup, other than Al Horford back in with Derek White. And with a high right hand dribble, Hero sets the screen. Horford in front of Bam is going to throw the shoulder into him, work his way into the paint, pounds it twice with the left hand, turns, fades, and hits. That's a terrible shot. 
I mean, you're going back over your body, and you're able to find the target in midair. Five straight, cuts to the 26, 101-75. Cross-court pass by Tatum, picked off. And as the long right was off to the races, Jalen Brown fouls, and that could easily be a clear path foul. Unless they determine that Jalen and DeLon Wright were sort of in the same place. That should have been clear, clear path. But now the Celtics getting a little, a little raggedy here. You know, what, what people have been talking about. Complete the task. You know, you're way ahead. You're saying, I'm nitpicky, I am. That's where you have to be if you're playing for a championship. Bam hands to Jaime Jaquez. Strong playoff debut for Jaquez. Shut off in the mid-block. Finds the cutter, Kayla Martin, and he gets in. Just beats Porzingis to the spot. Scores off the window, and now 7-0 run for Miami. Cuts her from 31 down to 24 with 6.06 to go. Looked like that sleeping part that Celtics had against Atlanta. Yeah, this is the, at the end of the season when yeah. everything's already wrapped up. Drew Holiday out of the wing. Pound century, Kristaps Porzingis. Turns on Bam. Pump fake, steps to his left, falls away and hits. There's no way on earth you can stop that. So 18 points for Porzingis in his Celtics playoff debut. All right, great entry from here on the hot kids who was all alone. Horford and Jalen Brown got crossed up. 103-79, Boston by 24. Clock still rolling here. Drew Holiday would just walk the dog. Got to make him touch it. If you can take time off the clock here, we're down to 522. Miami, the only thing I say about this is Quintese. Celtics having to work with theirs. Drew Holiday gets in deep, runs it off the glass. No good. Offensive rebound. Jalen Brown thought he was fouled on the putback. No he, call. He was fouled by Drew Holiday. Caleb Martin. Rough day for Caleb Martin. Dribbles behind his back. On the perimeter, push pass in the wing. Wright makes the extra pass into the corner for a Tyler Hero three. Best sequence for Miami since late in that first quarter. 12 to 2 is the run, and they have cut a 31 point deficit down to 21. 103 82 with 441 to go. Remember, the Celtics had this year, particularly against Milwaukee. Offense. Offensive foul on Tatum, another turnover. Tenth for the Celtics. Not done yet. Too much time left in today's NBA. I wouldn't mind bringing Derek White back in this basketball game. Control the initial point of attack. Celtics' largest lead was 34. Now it is 21 with 4.29 to go. Delon Wright stops straight away. His three is good again. 15 to 2. Miami run here. The line right up to 14 points after a big fourth quarter, and the Boston lead is down to 18, 103 85. Drew Holiday sees an opening, attacks the paint, then throws to the corner. Horford swings to Tatum. Tatum doesn't want to shoot, he wants to drive. He attacks, and misses the layup. Tatum missed the layup, and here comes Caleb Martin. Miami trying to make a gasp to get back in this thing. They find right for a trail three. Timeout, Joe Mazzula. 18 to 2 Miami run and they have not closed the door yet 357 to go in game one Boston 103 Miami 88 on the mid-MGM 98.5 the Sports Hub Celtics radio network how powerful is Cox internet powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas Phoenix and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage Get gig speeds powered by fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. The Coca-Cola Company, Cure Dr. Pepper, and PepsiCo are bringing consumers more choices with less sugar than ever before. From sparkling, flavored, and bottled waters to zero-sugar sports drinks, teas, and sodas, consumers are taking advantage of these choices. In fact, nearly 60% of beverages sold contain zero sugar. To learn more, visit balanceus.org. Get a great offer on the stylish HRV or the Honda Civic, which car and driver called fun to drive. Honda, the brand named Kelly Blue Book's KBB.com Best Value Brand for 2023. For a limited time, well-qualified buyers can get a 3.9% APR on a 2024 Honda Civic or HRV. v 
See dealer for financing details. Exclusive against I and Type R car and driver January 2023. Based on 2023 brand image awards from Kelly Blue Book. Visit KBB.com for more information. Channel your automotive passion into a rewarding career path. Whether you're a seasoned pro or just starting fresh, your local car star has a variety of opportunities to join this elite premier collision repair company. Get your foot on the gas and race to success with a career at CarStar. Explore the endless possibilities and visit CarStarJobs.com to learn more about how we drive excellence together. That's CarStarJobs.com. Start your journey with us today. The home of the Rivs, the Sports Hub. Austin Lee down to 15 with 3.57 to go. The out-of-town scoreboard brought to you by Nissan. You deserve a car that thrills you. Nissan's got an exciting full line that'll put goosebumps on your goosebumps. Experience a thrill for yourself. Shop your local Nissan store at NissanUSA.com. Today, we'll check the scores as soon as we take 10 seconds for station identification on the Bet MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. This is Boston. Well, a 26 to 7 run for Miami has cut 19 points off the Boston lead. But the good news for the Celtics is that lead was 34. Now it is 15 with 3.57 to go. And uh, what it looked like Joe Mazzulla was not going to have to do, Max, was just keep the starters in. Well, one thing he's doing bringing Derek White back in the game. I think he just controlled that initial point of attack. And you don't want Miami to feel any confidence at all. Ironically, as good as he was for the first three quarters, Jason Tatum is the only Celtic who's a minus in game one. Layup a minute ago. Drew Holiday chose not to take one earlier. Out of timeout, Holiday beats the pressure, pushing it ahead of Derek White in the front court. Miami, last gasp here, going all out, down by 15 with 3.49 to go. And the Celtics lost the big lead at Cleveland late in the year with nine minutes to go. Derek White moves it to Tatum against Tyler Hero, five in the shot clock. Tatum back to Derek White, pretty good looking at three. Got it. That's his triple double, isn't it? It is 19, 10, and 10 for Jason Tatum. A game one triple double. Bam gets him deep and scores with the hook shot easily over Porzingis. Well, Miami really scoring easy here. Yeah. They got 31 already in the fourth quarter with 3.15 to go. And as Holiday steps to his right, we're going to foul on the floor. Porzingis has drawn a lot of contact and fouls away from the play. Three on Bam, the second team foul. Free throw is not a factor here. Boston 6 of 8, Miami 6 of 6 here in game one. Porzingis, handoff Tatum, trying to turn the corner. Miami takes that away, so he steps back into a three. It's no good. Back iron, long rebound. Jalen Brown couldn't get it. It looked like Martin, though, knocked it out of bounds. The hustle of Jalen to get there changed the possession. It goes back to the Celtics, who lead by 16 with 3.07 to go. I'm trying to understand why, what's the sense of urgency of shooting the basketball with the shot clock having that much time on it. Eric White. Or Porzingis straight away, looks at another three, no good, wide left, and the rebound for Hero. Well, Max, there's your answer. Porzingis, four of eight from distance in game one. Hawkins drives, bounce pass to the corner, bam, for three, got it. And Miami has cut this thing from 34 to 13. And they've done it in eight minutes. Holiday pressured at half court, but he gets it away safe for the Derrick White. Boston lead it. It's 14. Jalen Brown in the corner, fumbles it, drives into the paint, falls away, throws it out to Porzingis. He up takes the three. Two long strides in the paint, runs it off the back iron, no good. And they Josh. call an offensive foul late against him. And Miami still alive here, but the clock is down to 2.29 to go. There is a discrepancy in the score on that last BAM shot. ABC has it listed as a three, but the scoreboard does not. So we're at 106. We'll say 92 for now, not 93. 14-point lead, not 13. Hero catches. Tatum takes the first three away. Hero gives it up to Caleb Martin. Return to Tyler Hero. On the wing against Derek White. Seven on the shot clock. Hero ducks the shoulder. Throws out to Hawkes. Fall away, 14-footer. Air ball. Rebound Howard in the weak side. Celtics just cinch up for one good possession defensively. And now Eddie Paladino will say two minutes left. Two minutes to play in the 
Austin by 14, trying to finish off game one. Derek White, deep on the left side. Porzingis sets the high screen. Derek White, right hand dribble. Stop and start. Attacks, bam. Floats it up, no good, but he's fouled. And Derek White will go to the free throw line with a minute 47 to go. Smaller, simple things. Attacking the rim, taking good shots, milking the clock a little bit, defending, having the attitude again at the end of the basketball game. The Celtics play that like it was all over. You cannot do that in the NBA basketball. You can. And normally, if you don't have a big lead like that, you know, good things don't happen. New Orleans OKC, 8 1 of the West. That's the wrap up game tonight as Derek White makes the first free throw. Indiana and Milwaukee, a lot of people are jumping on the Pacers now in that series. And then Dallas and the Clippers is the second half of this ABC doubleheader. Wow. What do you think of that series? Huh? I mean, it really depends on Kawhi, right? Yeah, if Kawhi's healthy, I mean, the opportunities could be there. Yeah, cameo of shot yeah, of Mike Gorman. Mike getting some love. He's not and he's not done yet, folks. Mike's going to be back at work on Wednesday night. He'll do the next few games before he wraps up his career as the TV voice of the Celtics. Falling away, bam, hits over Porzingis again. Miami's going to feel really confident about this fourth quarter. 108-94, Howden beats the pressure, gets into the paint, floats it out to the wing. Jalen Brown, right-hand dribble into the paint, and he gets fouled with a minute 30 to go. And it's not going to be pretty. Celtics aren't going to get any style points for finishing off game one, but no one's keeping track of style points anymore. They're, they're not, but well, look like Miami's going to challenge you. Might as well. With 90 seconds to go. Yeah, our friends at uh, NBC Boston will have games two through six of this series before they call it a season. Miami's challenging the defensive foul on right. Mike will have done nearly about 2,800 games. He'll be second to Johnny Most on most of the mere child's play. Yeah, you're gonna, you're really close to passing Mike to put you second to Johnny. But that's the play-by-play -play list we're talking about. Well, I'm just talking about, you know, when I was working with this other station at one time, you know, I was brought into the office for my first season and ended. I had to do some explaining. I said, look guys, this is my first year. And I'm gonna be better. 30 years later. <laughs> hey, how'd that work out, Howie? How, how many <laughs> you more were there? How many more meetings have there been since? Uh, zero. How many more end of season Absolutely meetings? Absolutely zero. We need to tell you something. Upon review, right chops across the arm, and the defensive foul stands. The challenge is unsuccessful. Miami loses the timeout, and they have no further challenges for the game. Well, just a little delay in getting to. Kyrie and Luca in the Dallas Clipper series. Man, all the home teams have won, though, haven't they? The home teams it will be 5 0 going into that game in LA. You know, but that's where the teams, if LA, depending on how healthy Kawhi is, they could be questionable at home with Dallas playing as well as they are. Milwaukee at home playing without Giannis tonight against Indiana. I think OKC got a great draw. For the first round obviously with the injury to Zion and that's sort of the you know not saying the saying the quiet part out loud a lot of star players here and be battling through injuries Giannis dealing with the injury Zion is out Kawhi is dealing is it a coincidence that we had the player participation policy this year and guys played so many minutes and now we have significant injuries as the playoffs begin uh -huh. I'll ask Alonzo Ball about that or any of the ball brothers Jalen Brown gets the free throws. Margin 16 now with a minute 25 to go. And you can't say this got scary. It didn't get scary. No. But it was disturbing how quickly Miami shaved all those points off the big Boston lead. Bam from the elbow. His jumper comes up short. Caleb Martin grabs an offensive rebound. Tyler Hero can't get into the paint. Throws back to Bam. 24.6 rebounds for Bam. Bam with four in the shot clock against Porzingis. Starts his drive. Here's the step back at 10 feet. Jumper comes up short. And Tatum gets undercut by Caleb Martin. 
Tatum pops up and walks away, and Jalen Brown gets right in the face of Caleb Martin. And if familiarity breeds contempt, these teams were already with each other. A scary looking play, but Tatum pop right back up. Yeah, that's what I like. Yeah. Tatum just takes the basketball away from Tyler Hero and walks to the other end to shoot free throws. Yeah. Yeah. Tatum went in to get the offensive rebound, and Caleb Martin went right underneath him, undercut him, and Tatum landed right on his back. He immediately, he grimaced, and then he popped right back up. As if to show Miami that he was hurt. <laughs> They've been calling the rescue guys out right now. Clear? Clear? All right, you like to talk all the time about the old days, the old days. If Kayla Martin did that in the 80s, what happens next? You know what's going to happen. You already know what's going to happen. Next next person down, <laughs> you better not blink. That's Tatum bounces do. in the first three. And I, I like that. I, I like the fact that Miami did it. But you know what that did? You want to wake somebody up? You want to have somebody play harder? He almost hit his head. Watch, when he goes up, he comes down, he hits, and he came close to hitting yep. his head on the ground. Because you have the natural whiplash mm -hmm. when you land. Tatum makes the free throws. A 21-point triple-double for Jason Tatum in game one. And he is on his feet here as we're in the final minute. Margin is 18. Hakez lost his dribble, throws it away, picked up by Tatum. Hakez has played hard, if not always well. Jalen Brown on the wing, back to Tatum. And now the fans are already on their feet because of the hard foul. Want to see Tatum finish this off in style. Pump fake, he draws the contact. The shot almost bounces in. And it's Caleb Martin who committed the foul. He just tapped Jason Tatum on the side of the hip. And it's on to game two. What kind of stuff there, boy? I, I, I like that. You, you want to wake somebody up? You want to give them a wake-up call? Well, by the way, Tatum got a little bit of Caleb Martin on yeah, that pump elbow. fake. Yeah, got him with the elbow. Tried to block his shot. And Tatum said, are you okay, is what he said to Caleb Martin after he clipped him in the face. So, times have changed. Oh, my God. I almost, almost threw up in the back of my throat when you said that. He said, what? Are you okay? Uh -huh. For the cheek on the second one, and there's a 20-point lead as we enter the final 30 seconds. Well, Miami made it go the distance and kept the Boston starters on the floor. That's about all I can say here. Cutting a 34-point lead down to 12 in the fourth quarter. And let's go Celtics chant now. Coming defiantly from the crowd. Hakez missed the three. Derek White has the rebound. He will walk it across half court. They will rise to their feet at TD Garden. And a season dotted by domination throughout. The postseason will begin with a 20-point win. The final score in game one, Boston 114, Miami 94. Back with more on the Red MGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. How powerful is Cox Internet? Powerful enough to let your band members in Vegas, Phoenix, and Rhode Island jam like you're all in the same garage. Get gig speeds powered by five. Fiber from Cox. It's internet built for tomorrow, today. Cox, always building better. Download speeds up to one gigabit per second. Cox internet is powered by fiber and connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Speeds vary and are not guaranteed. Cox terms and other restrictions may apply. Not all oils are created equal. John Deere proprietary oil blends are made for your machine to protect it from whatever comes your way. Choose the oil that was made for it. Find it at your local dealer or online at johndeere.com slash oils. Watch a three, got it. The NBA leader in corner threes hits that one straight away. And the Boston lead is quickly up to 19. One of 22 threes the Celtics make in a 20-point game one win. 114-94 is the final. Drew Holiday joins us from outside the Celtics locker room. And you're not the first guy I've asked in this position, but I'm always dying to know in the immediate aftermath, you've done everything there is to do in this game, but what is it like to play a playoff game in Boston as a member of the Celtics? Um, there's nothing like it. Uh, the energy here from 
when we're just out warming up the shoot is uh is insane so um to be able to play here via boston celtics makes me makes me pretty proud you guys play with a certain amount of vigor early in the basketball game defensively you guys were all over it then you slipped a little bit defensively late in the basketball game how do you pick that up um i just think really just being able to lock back in uh Obviously, being up 30 sometimes is a bit difficult, yeah. but we got to stay consistent, uh, be really good at the little things and simple things, and um, most of all, play as hard as we can. Jalen Brown gets, I mean, Tatum gets undercut. Big deal or no big deal? Oh, it's always a big deal. Um, <laughs> obviously, we, we play this game and we love this game, but when somebody, when, when that happens, um, obviously, we're going to stand up for our teammate. What's interesting about the week that transpired is you go the entire week, Usually, you know who you're going to play. You didn't. Was that a benefit in the way Joe was able to run this week where you're just focusing on what you need to do? Uh, it or definitely could be. I think for the most part, we try to do that uh, in the first place, uh, being able to just focus on, focus on ourselves and um, do the things that we need to do because we know we have the talent. Pretty cool week overall. How cool was it to get that Olympic jersey? Oh, it was great. Um, I'm not really into surprises, though, so I didn't really like that. Part, really? But no, <laughs> no, not at all. Guys. Not at all. But yeah, to, to see the jersey and and for Grand Hill to come to the house is cool. so cool. <laughs> so you I mean, well, you didn't have the place cleaned up or what? I mean, what's the big deal if Grand Hill shows up at your house with a jersey? I mean, it just I don't know. Some about surprises that makes me weird, but I don't know how to react to them. I mean. All right, filed away. The dude is a prepared guy. Doesn't like surprises. Well, you know game two is Wednesday. We know that ahead of yes, time. Sir. We'll see you there. Yes, sir. Thank you. 114-94 is the final. Drew Holiday, Chris Stott, Porzingis, their first playoff games as members of the Boston Celtics who win by 20 and move on to game number two. Final again, 114-94. We'll wrap it next to the BetMGM 98.5, the Sports Hub Celtics Radio Network. Now you can save on Cox Internet by adding Cox Mobile. So you can do everything you want, everywhere you want. Stream the big game with fiber-powered speeds at home. Or capture it courtside on your phone with unbeatable 5G reliability on the go. So you can do more without spending more. Learn how at cox.com slash internet. Cox Internet is connected to the premises via coaxial cable. Not all services and features available everywhere. Other restrictions apply. Looking to consolidate your debt, lower your interest rate, or need to borrow money? We can help. Borrow up to $50,000 with a personal loan from Westerly Community Credit Union. With our low rates, you can enjoy one monthly payment you can afford. Apply today at westerlyccu.com loan. Visit one of our branches located in Wakefield, Westerly, Richmond, or Coventry. Or call 401-596-7000 today. What a beautiful day in nature. Take it from a little bug like me. Nothing makes you feel more alive. <laughs> oh, whoa, I almost got frogged. That was a close call. But boy, do I feel capital A alive. Luckily for you humans, Nature's Way put that thrilling feeling of aliveness in a bottle. Nature's Way Alive Women's Multivitamin Gummies with 16 vitamins and minerals. Delicious multivitamins inspired by nature. Whoa, better luck next time, pal. Nature's Way. Without the ones like you, who work tirelessly to keep things running, everything would suddenly stop. Hospitals, factories, schools, and power plants, they all depend on you. No matter the weather, emergency, or time of day, you're the ones who get it done. At Granger, we're here for you, with professional-grade industrial supplies. Count on real-time product availability and fast delivery. Call, click Granger.com or just stop by. Granger for the ones who get it done. How do you make history? At Flagler College, you don't just learn. You create, innovate, and find where you truly belong. Your journey starts here. Flagler College, where history begins. Visit flagler.edu today. The generative AI revolution is coming to your smartphone, and it's fueled by Micron Mobile Solutions. Generative AI applications use billions of parameters to translate your text into images. Micron memory and storage solutions feed these parameters into generative AI models at light speed, turning your smartphone into a mobile creative workstation. See how Micron Innovation is accelerating AI innovation at micron.com forward slash AI. When you find a deal on your favorite thing,